focused mode. Yeah, that's focus mode. Enable. Entering focus experience mode. Huh. It's been a while since we visited Poseidon. Maybe we should head over and have a look around. Ooh. Okay, I don't care. I just want to save the cat. As long as we save the cat, I'm happy. I'm not saying shit. I need this. I need like 600 more primos. For just temple. just finish the story, you will love it. I am, f I am finishing it. Yeah, just finish. Well, I'm assuming I am. Hey, Traveler Paimon. Hey, Traveler Paimon. Oh my god, it's enough. it's the gay lord. It's a Fontanian gay lord. One of them at least. Yeah. Oh. <clears throat> oh, Paimon knows that voice. Yeah, Paimon knows that voice. Me too. Over Especially here. when I saw him already. Hey, Lenny. Me, Oz. Love Oz. To borrow one of the more popular terms, I always trust you, Kitty moment, Cat. This appears to be quite the faded reunion. Running into you, fighting the boss, I guess. Like this has really made my. Oh day. yeah, okay. Whatever. It's certainly wasn't expected. It's gonna be easy, anyhow. You can say that. Me, like fighting for him for two seconds. Hmm. I'm sure let's destroy him. Problem solved. Wait, Paimon's got it. You must be here for when your magic shows you on solo. Um, actually, we've run into a bit of trouble on the home front, Ooh. so father should, arranged for us to stay in Poisson for the time I being. I like this go on any farther. Oh, though. are Lynette and Fremine here too? Yep, along with most of the other members of the House of the Hearth. You may have noticed Poisson seems a bit more <laughs> Man, that was crowded easy. than usual. So you're saying nearly the entire organization has moved to Poisson? Sounds like you've run into way more than just a bit of trouble. What's really going on? A tiny little bit of trouble? Okay, um, good. I like it. Well... Oh my god, he stabbed since himself! The two of oh you shit! Are so curious, perhaps I oh shit! Oh no, we're getting assassinated! <gasps> you scared Paimon half to death! That's great, that's great. Oh shit, Is it's daddy. It's yeah. daddy. No, I mean, Is I first... gonna die again? No, it's not daddy, it's father. I mean, no, it's mother. I, it's mommy. It's, it's what is it? I don't know, man. It's all of them. Super confidential house of the heart. It's dominate me. <laughs> we totally weren't trying to pry or anything. Please stab me. No need to be nervous. She came out of nowhere. I yeah. Sense your genuine concern like the spider shit. Just now. Of course. I can also understand your confusion. Sending so many Fatui here to Poisson, it's only natural that some might suspect an ulterior motive to be involved. <laughs> well, we a little nice cool. Nice boss at 27k. I understand. Can I summon? I'm well aware you've had your fair share of confrontations with the Fatui in the past, and I can't exactly guarantee that we'll remain on good terms in the future. <laughs> As for right now, however, I would say we have little reason to be at odds, wouldn't you agree? The House of the Hearth could stand to be more open with those who have worked so closely with us in the past as for the issue at hand well it hardly relates to any ulterior motive to be frank it all stems from a certain rumor circulating oh, wow, around the house of the hearth it's an internal matter what sort of rumor a rumor that a certain phantom child is hiding away in the house of the hearth oh no they come with a Music again? Oh no, not the music. Not this music. I feel like I'm getting chills already. Oh yes! Oh, Lumi, the, the same! Ooh, just hearing the name <clears throat> is giving Paimon the creeps. A spirit that should have long ceased to exist is lurking in the shadows of the House of the Hearth. So I decided to bring the children to Poisson before continuing to investigate the situation. I expect I should be able to track down the spirit fairly quickly. After that, it's just a matter of resolving the situation, if you will. It shouldn't be much trouble at all. If you're curious, or if you still have some concerns, it might be advisable to stick around for a few days. I'm sure the children would be exceedingly pleased to welcome some visitors. Lenny, I'll leave you to entertain our guests. I have some matters to attend to. Of course, Father. Of course, Daddy. I have had my team. I have had my team. No! <gasps> Paimon shit herself. Nice. Paimon needs new diapers. Okay, that shit is... Hmm. It has 
long been a dream of mine to invite you to our home and introduce you to my other siblings. Nice. You're quite well known in the organization already. <coughs> a lot of people have been talking about you, especially after everything with the prophecy. Yeah, no. If you're willing, why don't you stay a while and have a little chat with us? Mm. Not plot right. armor. We don't have anything else to do right now anyway. But let's be clear, we're just gonna be there as guests, okay? Don't get any funny... Oh, wait a second. For your guests, that probably means we'll be treated to lots of yummy food, right? Oh my god. Of course. During our stay in Poisson, we've I mean, been helping out <clears> the locals <throat> with some I really, fish. I really want to see bring in quite the how much day. food there actually fact, will be now. Because from the enemy, enemy the we know Let's that they I'll get like no cake. <laughs> they get like the miniest piece of cake and cake ever. Okay? So, if there's gonna be food displayed anywhere, I want to see if that changed. Because I'm pretty sure Alexine would change shit like that. I'm pretty sure she would like, okay, we're getting food, okay? Not everybody gets like a tiny little bit of cake. No, no, no. Everybody gets its own fucking cake. I don't give a shit. Please tell me I get the cows pet. Please tell me I get the cows pet. Please, 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 please let me have the cows pet. We rented this house from yes, one of the locals His name is Monsieur Oz. Base. I'll come back later no, and tidy Monsieur up a bit. After that, it should be all ready for care. you to it's stay Monsieur in tonight. Oz. Awesome, thanks. So Monsieur Oz, no matter what. Told the shed. Well, when I happened to run into you two earlier, I was I'm actually sorry, in the middle of distributing some supplies. <laughs> I don't know, man. You probably just masturbated. Soul, we have to bring in outside supplies every now and then. I should probably make sure the rest of these provisions get delivered. Otherwise, people might start to get antsy. Okay, we'll come with. There are all sorts of rumors about your organization floating around out there. Primon's not sure if she could even take a wild guess as to what's true and what's not. But now that we finally have the chance to see a day in the life of the house, we can take a good look at how you operate. That's very interesting, well, yeah. I really want to wanna know along. what's Just going on me. in the House of the Heart. I'm actually curious. Like, I was thinking for that, like, pages ago already. Like, what the fuck are they even doing there? Like, we have, like, no I information just, uh, about anything about it. I mean, the only thing I could have thought of was, okay, yeah, all the Chinos, like, taking in children and shit. And, like, they were just doing shady shit to make money. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm thinking too, but that wouldn't even make sense. Like, Why, how would not? that would Why be too here? obvious, and then the, supplies. the authorities would basically Brought like with me? Yep. fuck Alexino in pieces or some uh, shit. Maybe they're just beautiful. Something caught your eye? Oh my god, he has a crush on Lumine. Never mind. No way! <laughs> no way! Travel on Paimon! Oh my god, it's King Pimpy and Paimon! I should rename myself to Fisher Sim 69 in that case, always. Look, look, it's Fisher Sim 69. One at a time, please. Don't crowd around just them all at once. Fisher Sim. We don't want to scare off our guests now, do we? Or the oh, it's Fisher right. Sim. Fisher Sim. Say, didn't realize the, you were his yeah. <laughs> Thy Fisher Sim. Of course. Father and Linny have told us so much about you. No, the Father has told us about how you helped Linny. Only. According to her, yeah, I guess, but nah, man. And as far as she's concerned, that's pretty much the highest compliment we've ever heard her give. As you can imagine, I have to be in role, okay? So, and I Fisher would say die. Die, princess, and bare hands. you know? I so it's. But die would be so much that she can clean up what? the entire pantry at Hotel de Bourne. It would be thyself, days. which means. Which Wait would be you referring to yourself, you not someone referring to you. Oh, no, I mean. But if I name myself. Thai. Uh, Fisher Simp, then characters that come along and say our name, oh, it's Thy Fisher Simp. That would be perfect. Like, you, you have to think it that way. You don't name yourself, you let others name you and call yourself that. So it makes sense. Yeah, but you would say the Fisher Simp, not Thy Fisher Simp. Why? Because Thy is yourself. It's like saying I. Ah, you okay. won't look. At, you won't look at someone and be like, Ah, oh, look, that's I Fisherson. Ah, okay, 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 I get it, I get it. It is me, oh, myself, wait. and I. When guests 
visit, you're supposed to yeah. give them gifts and stuff, right? Oh, we don't need something like that. Besides, we don't have anything to give to you. Come on, we insist. I can give you some of my new potions. Just pick your oh, poison. Oh, potions. And pick your poison. Mm. Or actual poison. You should. I got both. And I mean, medicine or actual poison, of course. Or and you it, man. <gasps> the you cat's here! The cat's the best it. part of this episode. Yes, for God. Oh, now that's not a bad it's idea. Like keep the cat as a pet. I know you please. usually prefer to fight please, head on, but it never hurts to expand your bag of tricks, The only thing I will have by my side is the cat. When it comes to please, eliminating your enemies, please, staying please quiet can go a long way. Trust me, I, I don't want know. it as a fucking animal in my serenity teapot. I want ago, it as a pet. I'm still dealing with the actual after effects. pet that follows me. So I'm not me. quite as good as I was Police. before, but I can still give you some pointers. Um, wait. Uh, when you said gifts, Hyland didn't think you meant poison. Um, nice. Is no one gonna notice the best this? Things we can give you. You don't like them? Is no one in Fontaine gonna notice Ooh, that there's a giant square flying in the sky? Tell me the name of someone who really Is New Land really gonna look over, see this shit, and be like, hmm, that's normal? I mean, dude, it's Tevert. Just don't expect anything. All right, Fold Selwar. I think that's enough suggestions for now. When it comes to I'm being a good one. host, it's the thought that Using counts. Six songs. You don't need a physical gift to make our guests happy. In the fact, the pestering them with yet? suggestion after suggestion might make them more annoyed than anything. I would say your enthusiasm has certainly gotten across. Really? Absolutely. We definitely feel the love. Awesome. It's been so long since we've had <laughs> guests to play with. If there's anything you need, just let us know. Just imagine some yeah. some fucking Especially dumbass child comes to you and be like, Hey, do you want some stealth that. techniques or poison from me? Well, we'll talk to you all bro, later. Poison. We've still got supplies to poison. distribute. Like, bro, bro, you later. why the fuck are they offering me fucking poison and stealth techniques? Like, hello? What's wrong poison. with these kids? Always go with poison. Bye. Oh my god, how they all say bye to me. I'm scared. Poisoning death tactics. Just now. <laughs> yeah. Scared you, did it? That kind of talk comes with being part of the House of the Hearth. <clears throat> we just call him Ozzy? When Foltz I was really young, Ozzy. he strangled Here's all of his arms. family pets. Just out of curiosity. He was labeled a dangerous problem child and was abandoned by Did his I family. Elwar has, a pet? has an unnatural riot? obsession with potions. Father has forbidden her from trying all the different concoctions she comes up with, but right she still here. tries to test them in secret. So I can do you really have now, to keep an eye on that, that one. That is today. Chaplot so is around my age. Well, I'm mainly responsible Chaplot is your for age? Bitch, you look like 12. He surveillance. He's very passionate about his work I mean, and has no reservations 14, about taking you know, on some very difficult 15. missions. I know you I two probably aren't used to that kind of talk, <laughs> but I can promise you they only had the best of intentions. Things like stealth I mean, tactics Lunny, and developing different poisons. He's probably like they really mean a lot to them. 19. They were just 17, 18, I would say. I would not even That's say all. 19. Like he, he seems oh, too yeah. he's too flirty. I don't think he's 20 or some shit. Or 19 or some garbo. I think he's like maximum 18. Just I mean, because the thing, is, the thing is if you're gay, you're gonna stay flirty for longer. The thing is he's flirting with Lumine the entire time. And He's flirting good, I like mean, he has yeah, Riz. But that's, just, that's just best friend. That's, that's just the best friend for like, You know, you do that with your best friend anyhow. I guess, and but keep in mind, he has like <gasps> more Riz than Outsiders. anybody of ours, easily. Huh. Allow me to like he's actually Riz Lord. This is the traveler I mean, there's also uh, Rizly, oh. I don't know. He's Your not rizzing shit, well, man. He's just so teeing. It's nice to meet you. Man, that's how he rizzes people. He just tees. He doesn't need to do anything Yeah, he tee poses and he's like standing like in the tee pose and Clone is like, oh my god. My clothes, why are they disappearing? Oh, good it for was, you. Everyone's like, where the fuck are my clothes? You man? must be pretty everyone's familiar with Fontaine by now, then. Clothes. Have you seen the really new opera that started posing? running recently? Uh, tea posing his way through the fucking city. The 4,000 Thieves? Oh, this is the first we've heard of it. It seems like it's going to be fantastic. Uh, from what I've been able to tell from the posters, anyway. How far do you think I can get You should definitely the, check uh, it out if you have the time. I don't know. And there's at the blind too. maiden too. <laughs> then it's that five levels. supposed to have audience interaction. Seems pretty good. 30 level is 30 is one level. 
after this it should be mission is over, them because I it's five levels and I was, when I was last year was at 42. Oh, uh, maybe I should dye my hair. Yep. 54. Uh, I <clears throat> wonder how much it'll cost. Next, the two wishes um, from is it just Paimon or do these two seem much just by what my goal easier will be. to get along with than the others? Obviously, Looks like the House of the Hearth has some normal members after all. I'm not going to get anything else from the fountain I heard that. Oh! Uh... Oops. <laughs> oh, I maxed it out. I'm guessing you're referring to Foltz and the others. <laughs> yeah, I maxed we're it definitely out. not all like them. I um, bet those crazies are practically foaming at the mouth right now. <laughs> I'm sure they just can't wait to get back to Snezhnaya to carry out the plan. Ooh, okay. That's enough, okay. I just maxed it out. That's, that's Don't great. talk about family members behind their back, right? <laughs> Whatever. Let's go. Let's go. I need a four star um, so I can do another full game, goodbye, please. Then. Give me another four star. If you ever have some time, we should go see oh the God, opera together. Me. I'm sure I need for a temple. I need, a, I need 140 for a temple. <sighs> Good luck. Just because the game well, wouldn't give me that's a single... Supplies. Oh my God. We should probably head back as well. Dude, not gonna lie, the patch so far, pull wise looks very dry. Well, they didn't seem Please. too happy with each other. Seems like there could be something more going on here. Uh, that is like another 30. Oh, wow. You're That's right. actually a shit ton. We're only here as guests. That's not a shit ton of achievements. How much do you actually oh, need? Uh, Linny's getting super far ahead. Come on, let's catch up. Let's chase Linny. Okay, um. Linden, why? 20. No. Looks 18, like there's more trouble right? in store next month, too. No, 28. 28. <sighs> 128 is how much I need. Hey. Just focus on the positives. At least our time in Poisson has been pretty relaxing. Don't you think? They're a couple, I can smell it. They're banging, Is definitely. Uh, you will see. If it has if it's Lenny and a female, I highly doubt it. It's not. So what do you okay. think of the members you've met so possible? far? It's like saying, it's like, it's like Venti <laughs> well, and Father is always female. encouraging That's us to be unlikely. strong willed and independent. Venti and who? So if there's one thing we've got, the female? it's people who aren't oh, afraid yeah. to speak their mind. Well, Except I Babu, once again. Want to join? Of course! I don't know. Then let's head out and. Uh huh. Fremine? Oh shit, it's Fremine! What are you doing here? Ooh. Uh, it's other fanboy. Well, um. Oh, uh, you too. I heard you're here as guests of House of the Hearth. Welcome. We were just going to make some food. Why don't you come along? Oh, you know what? I, can I go could to use some help in the kitchen, and I seem to remember you mentioning no, you wanted to it. make seafood soup for the trap. I'm going to turn my bed and watch. Do that, buddy. Mm, seafood soup? Oh, Paimon is drooling already. <laughs> Were you looking Probably for chat something with just the phone now from dude. Maybe I can help. Uh, As you wish. It's nothing. I just wanted to see if there were any extra supplies. Yeah, we've got some left over. What do you need? Some food and water. And some clean cloth, if possible. No problem. Give me a second here. Food, water... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What do you need all of those for? You're not on any missions as far as I'm aware, and you were just going to come eat with us. So what's this all about? I... Uh, I thought I'd grab an extra portion Reminisce because vital. I get okay. hungry at night. Could Ooh. be because I'm growing, you know? And... He's so bad at lying, man. Fremine. No comes the interesting we, part. I mean, you remember what I told you? From the picture lying. alone, we, we already know who it is. Work. It's Pinky. Oh my God. Tell me what's going on. Is it really bad enough that you have to keep it from your own brother? Um, maybe it'll be better if we gave them some space. Uh, huh. This is the first time I've seen kind of look yeah. on your face. Something like that. I don't remember the name. Does it have something to do with father? <sighs> yes. 
Just follow me. Okay, time to follow the shy fanboy that apparently has a waifu. The guy gets more bitches than me, it's fucking terrible. Sounds terrible. I guess I need a helmet. Oh, oh I found I found the uh, guy you're talking about. Hello, my name's Linny. The uh the I grew up in the about. house of the hearth. Oh. Okay. And you are? I'm gonna fight him. I'm just fighting him with my Hi, um, Linny. Ganyu. I'm also a child of the house of the heart. Just like you. You guys kinda shitty buds, alright? Clairvy? Clairvy? I, mean, I am using Nahida, because I'm nice using um Thorn Melt. Does that name ring any bells, Lenny? No, not at all. That's not a name we have on our roster, I'm sure of it. What I'm not sure Her of eyes are spooky as fuck, is man. how she managed to sneak in. <laughs> Ew. She must be the phantom child huh? father's been searching for. Here's eyes. From the looks of it, I'm guessing the pink-head bitch one from the picture. Me. You, uh, haven't told father, have you? No, I haven't told anyone. I've just been... I mean, considering that she's pink-haired, you don't like her? For how I mean, long? she looks like a fucking demon. She's probably About yoinking my fucking soul. I'm not gonna lie. Now. So ever since we got mm. to Poisson, then, do you I'm have any like, idea what you're so doing? Shit this boss. I know I'm what I'm doing. This shit. I'm not dealing with this shit. Really? No thanks. Because from where I'm standing, it looks like you're no, hiding the very person me, Father can't. has been trying to find. If Father finds Jeez. out about this, everyone involved is going to be punished. You know the rules of the house, Fremenet. I know you do. Father doesn't tolerate any form of betrayal. So why are you doing this? I've why it through. are they searching for the... And I just the can't ship. hand her over like that. Linny, don't you remember last year? Shaplo nearly died after getting poisoned during that one mission. He wasn't able to get back before the poison started taking effect. Mm. And not a single person was there to help him. That night, while I was sleeping... I heard a voice telling me to go save him. I'm for me I opened to, my uh, eyes, but no, I couldn't yeah, find the source of the voice. This thing to death. I thought maybe I was just hearing things, but I went to look for him anyway. Luckily, I got there with enough time to save his life. That feeling of being haunted, of hearing voices, it's happened many times in the house one, of the heart. Uh, thing that I'm, missing. I'm sure you've noticed. So what you're saying is, that was her? She was the one who spoke to you that night? Mm, this seems accurate. Unless there are other spirits roaming around the House of the Hearth, I don't think there's any other possibility. If Claire V were our enemy, it wouldn't matter whether she was a spirit or an actual child. I would have acted without a second thought, because that's what Father ordered us to do. But she's been living with us. Helping us from the shadows all this time. I think that makes her family. I couldn't just hand her over to be dealt with. Not when there's so much we still don't know. So Why what's your plan then? You reading? can't keep her here forever. Someone is bound to find out eventually. What? I haven't it's thought that far yet. Hmm. I don't want to disobey an order from father. But I also He's don't want me to out put of the arena. in danger. Come with me. There are a couple things I'd like to say to you in private. Oh my fucking god. Linny serious? Holy shit. <clears throat> That's my arrow. <clears throat> Linny be like, I thought you would be my boyfriend to feminine. <laughs> Those two sure care a lot oh about each other. <laughs> well, I didn't know that, that Where Paimon was floating, it sure seemed I mean, like they're not blood related. I no believe. way! No. They have a really deep bond. We just still pretty friends. Tell right away, cause ah, it's whatever. Have a like that. I just I mean, don't know is that my how problem? long that kind of bond can say. last. The darkness in the house runs deeper than you can imagine. She looks so fucking no dead inside. Not gonna lie. I'm sorry, Liddy. I really didn't mean to drag anyone else oh, into man. this. Oh man, he just killed Jean Lee. Oh really? You that didn't mean to? Cause I, for one, wish you did. Huh? What do you mean? Goodbye, you know, I guess. When we were younger. You didn't call me Linny. 
You called me brother, just like Lynette. Is Wait, he called brother Lynette? The three of us. We were uh -huh. all orphans. Is Lynette all A.O. brother? Was it? We both of all the siblings in the house of the hearth, I, I mean, think our nah, bond was the closest. Nah. Later on, when you started mm. calling me Linny, I wasn't actually surprised. After all, Lynette and I are related by blood. We've had to depend on each other to survive mm. long before we joined the house. Linny, I... The darkest and most difficult moments of my life happened but before you and I had ever met. But think it is like met. being the I'm daughter sure of true for you as well. Crusabena. Even so, Fremen. I wonder if she's dead inside. Stood by I mean, I guess. All these years now, and to me, that means more than blood. You and Lynette are the most important people in my life. No one can replace you. So I won't let you face anything alone. I like this happy music oh, while they're I talking can't. like they're about oh, to fucking die. Like things it's, are getting kind of heated between Lenny and Fremen, eh? Maybe we should go check on them. <laughs> It's getting heated between them two, yeah, because they start to kiss soon. Uh, <laughs> hey, minute, Lenny. Like a fight, uh, or... Oh, damn. wait a minute, <laughs> Fremine, you're not crying, are you? Is everything all right? When it's when it's kind of stand at in the mirror Thanks and in asking. the wedding because well, she doesn't know well, if she well, should say that right? she's. Um, from so his brother or his so brother? If yeah. Anything we can do to help, just say the word. Oh my god. It's just a the family tree. No. It's not something it's a our fucking guests circle. should trouble themselves with. She's like, who's brother? In I fact, mean, who's sister? Am I? It might be better if your stay ended here. Uh, what are you getting at, traveler? When guests Chris, are around, I'm just saying, no spoilers, please. Are often on their best behavior. And any disputes are but from the name alone, it was to be expected, so I let it slide this That's time. What you're trying to say, isn't it? I it slide this time. Just. I mean, you didn't let it slide, but Noah. <laughs> Thank you. That was different, okay? I was really hoping. Because that, that was not really. That was no, like uncool. No, I'm just saying. I'm not saying that you're wrong. You're doing your thing. I'm just saying you didn't let us find Noah. Well, yeah, because that was I know straight up dangerous. spoiler where I didn't I expect this. anything from it. But from here, on, that that's I'll like, you like yeah. My life depends on it. Me too. I mean, it was conforming. Uh, well, back to well, the matter I at see, hand. What? I, but if we don't plan on handing Claire me over to Father, uh, then yeah. our only other option is to solve the mystery of her identity before Father is able to track her down. That means finding out where she came from and what she's doing here. Then we can send her on her merry way and pretend like none of this ever happened. I've tried that already. This jellyfish. Am I close enough? And? Am I close enough still? Yeah. And... Nothing. I tried taking her somewhere really far away, but after some time, she just reappeared. She even came with us all the way to Poisson. It seems like wherever the house is, um, she follows. Bro, bro, you okay? Oh my fucking god. I don't know much about you spirits. Okay, Do you two have any ideas? I... let's see here. Oh, I... Paimon remembers hearing something like... If you fulfill a spirit's last wish before they die, they'll let go of whatever is keeping them here and return to the ley lines. Oh, it's just that Paimon doesn't really remember where she heard that, so... So, it's not guaranteed to work or anything. Well, sounds like it's worth a shot. Guess that means we should go ask her about her wish. Man, why is Jellyfish First, so fucking broken? Fremine, I don't know. I, I don't know why they did that something. thing. Even that thing is so OP. I need you to promise me that this will stay between the two of us. We're the masterminds behind this whole thing. No one else gets involved. Can you do that for me? Is that way of for you or some shit? I promise. All right. Then let's seal the promise just like when we were kids. Fist bump on three. Ready? One, two, three. I have an two, idea. Three. Or well, theory, but I don't want to say it out loud. Where the fuck did she come from? <laughs> but it's hilarious. Oh, out of fucking nowhere. She's like, the fuck? Whoa. Lynette. Oh my god. But 
What a surprise. <clears throat> what brings you here, dear sister? A fucking look in the eye. He's like, hmm. And, uh, when exactly did you get here? <laughs> this is hilarious. She's me. She, nah, man. She's she's not happy. You're an idiot, brother. Um. And you too, Fremenet. <clears throat> uh. You three, traveler, and you four, Paimon. <laughs> you three, traveler. You four, Paimon. <laughs> I've seen nah, man, that's the so house good. of the hearth before. I hadn't seen her in Poisson, so I figured she must not have come with us. <clears throat> but it turns out you were just hiding her. I heard you talking about your plan. Rather than steering clear of the yeah, situation, agree. I'd rather fully join Not only you. the animation, but also the audio. Like the sound effects they put in there at these agree. places were pretty I good. I have no choice but to report everything back to father. Simple as that. Time. <sighs> You're not giving us much wiggle room here, Lynette. <laughs> You're not giving us. Well, I guess we're all in this together then. After mm. we talk to Claire V, mm. we'll figure out our next move. There's no time to lose. Let's go. I'm pretty sure Daddy already. I mean, Father already. I mean, Mommy already knows. Because guess what? She's right there. <laughs> she just fucking attacked you with a pole arm. <sighs> I'm full. Thank you for bringing me this food, you guys. Oh, yeah, um, I need to pray that, right? Because she's I need to full, but the food doesn't look like it's even been touched. As I started speaking. Amazing. She can actually eat. That's right. Based on what I've been able to observe, it doesn't seem like Clairvy can interact with the physical world at all. Still, when she's presented with food, She'll always linger around it for a good little while. Maybe, in her mind, she really is eating those things. Does she know that she has already passed away? I've tried to ask her, but she didn't answer. My guess is that she's just as confused as we are. Or... Maybe she couldn't understand the question at all. Clairvy, mm. if you've got some time... Mm. I'd like to ask you a few questions. Mason back. Welcome sure. back. Oh, another new friend. Hi, I'm Clairvy. Okay. Um Hello. Hello. Clairvy, how did you join the House of the Hearth? Huh? Isn't it the same for everybody? The knave brings you here and then you can't leave. <laughs> the it's knave brings that, you here and then you can't the name, leave. It's not on the roster. And I've never seen you before. The roster? Yeah, let's go this one too. Oh, I get it now. I got like, I swear, I got like I every think single there might fucking be some things that you they don't know released. about this place. The people in charge, they're not as nice as they look. I mean, it wouldn't they surprise me if someone told me I did. But it's like, not oh, complete. Yeah, it kind of makes sense, to be honest. There are a lot of people who aren't on it, and never will be. In this house, some people are family, and other people are just test subjects. Those kinds of people aren't ever going to get a place on the roster. Like eighty-seven percent on the new area. Unless like it's the, the roster of area. people who've been executed. Wait, does does that mean the name? I'm disappointed in myself right now. Is there anyone that can vouch for you? How would you have this much shit done already? Perry, she's my best friend. She's the only one I trust in this place. Have either of you heard of that name before? No. Me neither. Claire V. Perry. Perry. Do you have a key? Neither of those names are on the There's roster. No Perry the platypus. No, there wasn't like a different the truth. Either that, or this kid's already got a bag of tricks bigger than mine. Hmm. Maybe we should try a different I approach. I don't have a key, but I swore I got a key. Clairvy, do you have a wish? Like, I actually swear I got a key. A wish? It can be anything you want. Just imagine. It's your birthday, you're blowing out the candles, oh. and your okay. wish is... Now it comes. To, to 
go outside where the sun can find me. Is this? Aww, that's fucking sad, man. It? Well, that sounds easy enough. The darkness in the house runs deeper than you can imagine. No one can get out alive. Okay, time to divide and conquer. Listen up, I've got a plan. I'll try and find a way to use basic illusory magic to take Clairvy outside and bring her somewhere with sunlight. Lynette, try and find the list of executions that Clairvy was talking about and see if her name is on it. Fremenet, you stay in Poisson. We can't be the only ones who've had run-ins with Clairvy. I need you to collect intel on everything she's said and done. Understood. I'll try my best. What about us? What should we do? I really appreciate your willingness to help, but this is a family matter. I don't want to drag you in too deep. It's too risky. It's fine. We're Let me think. We're used to almost dying. Since father considers you to be guests, maybe you, you could stick by her patch? side for a little while. You don't need to do anything except keep up some nice casual conversation. So you're up 4.8 now, and oh, that's when you're almost right again. Gets it. You want us to distract her. I'll give you a magic bird. If father suspects something, all you need to do is release it when she's not looking, and it'll alert me that something's wrong. Of oh, course, balling. that's only as a last resort. If father doesn't seem to notice us, there's no need to make contact. We'll reconvene here tonight after all said and done. If the worst case scenario happens and we're discovered, just tell father everything. We're not going to let our guests get punished for our own actions. That's where we draw the line. Now, nah, man, she can kill too. us. We have plus armor, it's okay. fine. We're this good. is where we part. Father should be at the beach nearby. I mean, in theory, I would say. I hope this goes well. The lolly no, only exists it because has to go well. Arctic Chino. That's the only way this can get resolved. Like she, they're connected to each other somehow. Anything else would already make no fucking sense because nobody else would know about her. So it's weird. It's all because of daddy. I mean, mommy. I mean, father. I, mean, I don't know. One of them three. Oh my god! I'm fourteen. I'm 14 kilos off from a temple. Good shit. Speaking about temple, I have 500 Primo gems. Nice, I got a, a rocky boy. I'm sorry to inform you, but that's that's not for you. I'm well aware. Also, I'm going for single pulls. Fuck that shit. And the waiting. If I can get a good amount in a day, I will wait. If I can't, I'm, I'm not hiding. There's no way I can. I'm on to you. Gabling addiction. No, I just don't want to wait. If I get her today, that means I can get um, her weapon upgraded. So pulling is like pointless. Pulling does the exact opposite effect of what it should do right now. I mean, not putting, I'm mean, saving. Like, if I get the pole arm right now, I can instantly level up, up to level 90 and everything is fine. Which is way too fucking good right now. Okay, got jack shit. Nice. Oh my god. I have a it's him. Nice, nice. I'm coming to my temple. It's the knave. Why the fuck is he? I don't want to know, man. Hey, aren't you supposed to be in Snezhnaya nice. recuperating? What are you still doing in Fontaine? Oh, it's you two. Oh, I didn't expect to run into you here. <laughs> okay, fucking dying. I like it. <gasps> oh my god! I was unconscious for quite a while after the fight in the Primordial Sea. Sure. After I woke up, I realized I was being I'm taken back to Snezhnaya. To, uh, well, Do that. I couldn't have that now, could I? Not when I've still got unfinished business here in Fontaine. So, 
I mustered up all my strength and made the journey back on my own. Similar color. What sort of unfinished business are we talking here? Mentally ill. I like it. Has to do with Skirk, my master. I really wanted to meet up with her, but by the time I got back, she had already left. I still have so many questions for her. Thing is, do I get without any other leads? All I could do was ask the knave to help me track her down. Premine, have fun. Traces from her time in Fontaine. No, I want. I want Premine. I don't think I'm gonna get all the Chino, but I want Lynette. Premini. I want Lynette. Premini. Unfortunately, Lynette. no. Lynette. Lynette. While the House of the Heart is Lynette. adept at collecting all manner of intelligence, certain existences Lynette. can still manage to escape you. our purview. Basically, you come? unless Master it's feels there's a need to meet with you, Ling, it was she's not going Lynette. to be found. I told you. But no, the thing is, you dipshit, you don't want Fremini, so I have to say Jungling. That's your issue. It's, I don't give a fuck. I don't want either of them. I just want no, no, Fremini. There you go. I don't care. Lynette. Fremini. <laughs> no, the worst Lynette. of it is over. Fremi. Fremi. It's all thanks to that no, just from the Lynette. House of the Hearth. No. Physical <laughs> claymore that is not dog shit you though. random potions to drink. Was, they didn't go down easy, better, right? let me tell you. Nah, man. And chills Give all me over. my Lynette. But they really did help speed up my recovery. I'm actually, I'm actually and that's pissed, good, right because it looks like I really I'm do have to head back people this time. Now. The old man's been putting okay, the pressure well, on me. Okay, wow. Happens all he the time, thanks. tell me I'm needed for some sort of project. No. Project Stasia? Yeah, that's the one. <sighs> I heard Regrater's involved, too. I'm not looking forward Re to having Re to all his monologuing, that's for sure. Hey, maybe I you could think of a way for me to stay in Fontaine for a little longer. Helping Linny and the others brush up on their fighting C5. skills would be far more interesting. That's C5, Zhang Ling. If you and I could spar, that would be even better. I've been waiting for a chance to see you go all out. And what a sweet little daydream that is. But I also have a role to play in all this. I'll be leaving Fontaine Need shortly one as gives well. Her most, like, vital Besides, consolation. considering how little her they see fit e. to step outside the homeland, Imagine not having a second E already. Snezhnaya by such illustrious dignitaries. What a great honor. Wouldn't you agree? <laughs> one I could do without, I'd say. Uh, <laughs> is it just Paimon? Or does it kind of seem like they're... Just casually trash talking the colleagues behind the back. So, dear guests of the House of the Hearth, to what do I owe the visit? Um, well, we just. Um. Pumpkin. I don't think anything else I can really do right, right. But now. Right! I'm not doing. I don't want to do all the things right others, now. But we still don't That's know tough. much about you! I just don't want to, man. Is I've that so? Introductions have already got 90 been made. percent on the underground area. Oh! Uh, I have 98 well, on the upper see, ground area. There's only so much you can learn Man, about I someone from a short introduction. At least tell us something a little extra. Like, why do you call yourself father? Huh, good question. I'd also like to know. I would also The fact like that you have to ask tells me our intelligence work has been quite successful. I, Telling I you the answer to that question would only serve to undermine that success. And we can't have that, now can we? Spoken like a true diplomat. That was some expert sidestepping right there. <clears throat> well, if there's nothing else, I think I'll take my leave. I still have a small matter to resolve at home. Uh, uh, wait, do go! Oh my god, Pima No, why did you? I'd also like to hear the answer to this. <laughs> I also want to know I've met some of the members of your organization, and they all seemed like nah, really good man. kids. They actually reminded me of Tonya and Tusser. Which, by the way, if you ever betray them, I'm just letting you know, I won't let you off easy. And why would I betray them? <clears throat> well, you've already betrayed the House of the Hearth once, haven't you? <clears throat> At least... That's what I heard. Oh, nice story. Mm. Mm. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> you're just about to die. I'm just saying. The rooster, I would not I mean. Speak further. Who is it? Um, I don't want to. Do something bad to those what? Kids? Depending on who it is, it would depend if I will or would not speak further. I would say, um, 
I'm not saying it because it would be major spoiler, kind of. Because you you will be surprised, and that's like, nah, I, I, I couldn't do that. Never mind what I've done. I'm more curious right, as I'm to what sure the mighty doing, rooster had to say. Tomorrow, or, Care to enlighten um, me? That probably will never happen. Well, nothing much. Wait, why is Just some tomorrow, stuff so about you taking out many other members of the House of the Hearth, and even going so far to attack your own family. No, well, no, because hmm. I need to do it because it's the Reaper boss, right? I see. Oh, yeah. Based on your reaction, I'm guessing yeah, so it's I'm all a bunch of I mean, of lies. technically, you can do the Hardly. quick start to the boss. That should be possible phrase, thing to do. But I suppose he didn't say anything <clears throat> untrue. Yeah, then Although, you don't have to technically. It would be more accurate to say that there is a anyways. certain level of prejudice involved, but I don't intend to clear that up just yet. Should I go fight on now? Prejudice like, do has the, a funny way of concealing the, the real on? truth behind or should I just things. Wait till I... I An think, attribute you know, that I find to be you. quite advantageous. I mean, it's not going to refresh till Monday either way. Example, and people yeah. assume so all days. sorts of things. Dude, it's Thursday. It's not even Thursday. I mean, it's, it's now Thursday. In my used. area. Huh? Like, you're good. You have like still four days. And since you don't play Honkai Impact you third, you have to have an update there tomorrow. To protect the children it's going to be tough, right? Claiming that I myself was a Fontanian simply made it easier I mean, to operate. Play, you know, like, People would hardly suspect a fellow on. Fontanian of having really? any ulterior motives. Who wouldn't want sure to save their valid. homeland after all? The primordial seed wouldn't have any effect like, on me, but it would have caused oh. great harm to the yeah, House of the Hearth. Like Aha, the primordial seed wouldn't have an effect on her. Okay, that's interesting. Didn't you? There you go. That's very interesting because that that means she's not Fontanian. There we go. That's all I needed to know. So this is why she can't do the dolphin. So you stayed in Fontaine for the kids. I guess I was wrong to believe you'd betray them. Apologies. Looks like I was holding on to some prejudices myself. Good. Like I said, I, mean, I like it world, when bro, others have misconceptions of me. Actually, she really said, said that two sentences before that. Heart, well, yeah, but... There was something else that really caught my attention. I heard that members always resolve disputes and arguments with a friendly spar, and the loser has to back down. Seems pretty cool if you ask me. Would also give them plenty of opportunities to hone their skills. Well, that's only a recent development. In the past, you know such spars weren't nearly mm. so... friendly. Since I have, like, almost no artifacts to level up, right? lose everything. Um, if a artifact... Like, you know how hey, you have that artifacts that, like, it has, like, a, Ooh, a, um, not a thing anymore? is a three-white well, three title, and it, not it like, depends bad. on what the fourth line I'm is, it jealous, depends actually. if it's good or bad. You've yeah. had so many family four. members around you, um, and you even get to live with them. If it's bad, when I look having a lot of family around means dealing with a considerable mm. amount of bickering okay. and scheming. That's point, because... Once Tonya and Tusser enter their rebellious phase, I'm sure you'll understand. Just imagine... Tusser becomes obsessed with plucking out strands from the rooster's mustache, or Tonya decides to dye her hair 42 different colors. <laughs> 42 different colors. Okay, okay. I get the picture. Oh my god. Wait, this has ER. I like that. Does it have any ER? <laughs> He's no, getting scared. <clears throat> <clears throat> well, would you look at the time? I should probably get going. Traveler, Paimon? I'm not sure where our paths will cross next, but the next time we run into each other, we should definitely try and find some time to spar. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he's dying um, again. Again, maybe this is a conversation we can have when you look less like you're gonna kill over. All right, all right. Well, <clears throat> thanks for everything, Arlequino. No thanks necessary. You also played a part in obtaining the Gnosis. I, mean, I would say we can call ourselves own. even. <laughs> but I like great. the sound of that. Yeah. Well, I'm Same off. Time. See you all some other time. Um, we should probably get going too. Do you want to head back with us? Aww. Oh, you want me to leave so soon? Oh, I. Well, well you see. Um. Right, right. Damn. I'm rather enjoying the evening breeze. If you don't mind, I, I so think cool. I'll stick around for a bit. I have some things to think about. Apologies Damn. for not attending to you like a proper host. Please forgive this slight. I do hope you'll have a pleasant stay. Damn. I like the way she's speaking. 
We managed to keep her distracted until nightfall. With Good thing Child was there to keep degree. the conversation going. You don't think she suspected anything, do you? Oh. oh. You decided to. She had a second more. sentence, and I just completely skipped it. Nice. <sighs> Let's take in the ocean view together then. Is it bad that I'm the only four-star artifacts right now? No, because you have to. If you want that one pull. I will kind of do, but also it's instructor, so it can't be that bad, right? The normally talking is intimidating. Yeah. And there's no stamina left. Okay, have flying. I'm not the biggest fan of it. I'm honest. It's pretty shit. I mean, yeah, because it's free now. Not only that, it just I have one draw. Okay, my my one is faster because of the book. He can go wherever he wants to as well. Up, down. Well, no, not down. Long no, story short, we ran into a small issue. And she's like locked to the Where ground. Can't go into That's the bad. Sunlight. Like. That's very terrible. Nice. Then we have the problem that now. she's using stamina and Bondra just doesn't, okay? He's using his own shit. So I can have like infinite stamina, basically. If I just use Bondra, let him fly and then run and then like dashing constantly and then all the shit we heard. It's like, yeah, pretty bad. Poke Daddy reminder. It's pretty tough. It's totally. Oh, beautiful. Everything was fine at first. She followed me up to the surface just like I told so you her. Get nothing now, I guess. And in the sunlight, she just disappears, probably. But as I no, let her out of the nice. shadows and into the sunlight, she vanished. I turned around, and there she was, standing at the edge of the shadows, silently watching me. I'll find it's like a bonus for getting over water huh. or something. Maybe she's afraid of someone. Yeah, I guess. Or... But it's no, once again, it's worse than the villet. Kinda. I mean, not really. Mm. Nullet. Well, we could always. Ah, no, it's it's kind of worse than the Because once again, stamina. Oh my god. Holy shit. What? Oh, true. I've pretty much tried I didn't it all. Already. I just saw something Nothing I never worked. saw before. Eventually, what? the sun went down, so all I could do was bring her back here. You probably saw this before, but I'm just amazed. How did I it go with you, Lynette? Good. I've got the list. It's right here. Really? Well, oh my god! Wait, what? Katana? Okay, I didn't even know that it existed. Oh my god, I wanted. Oh, that's a lot of pages. Oh, it's gonna take forever to get through it all. Like, like, like mythical reward, I know that it exists. Here. But the thing is... Sin Katana, that's so fucking good. It is definitely me. Hooray. Hooray! You cut it for me, but it was me. All along, don't worry. Jimbel. My god, these baguette oh, names, I can't. That Hooray guy has a huge scar on his face. He's kind of given Paimon the creeps. Of, of, um, French names. Ah, I've met him before. Yeah, I'm French phobic. The scar is from an injury he received during a mission. I know. A lot <laughs> I of still people. remember him joking with me about it. it. He said any future lover would take one look at him and then lose all interest. Did oh, do you want to know something that, that I know you would be kind of pissed off about it? Well, I asked what? if there was something well, you he was interested off about it, but you'd be like, ah, oh, yeah, he that said makes no, a lot of sense and now. That's where our what? conversation ended. No, it was has only blood, later has that French, I learned he really blood. did have someone he liked. Ew. He and that as a fucking Russian penguin? Her, what the fuck's wrong with him? It didn't work. Once One again, day, like I said, you, you, him, it's not that like and, it'll piss you off or anything. Well, you'll just be like, oh, now everything makes a lot more sense. I never saw him again after yeah. that. Yeah. Wait, so that means the knave, she... Time to get rid of his blood. It may seem cruel, but it's just one of the rules of the house. Betrayal is not to be taken lightly. We know too many secrets to come and go as we please. So, if you do try to leave, you pay with your life.
Her name's not here, huh? Well, that's not too surprising. It doesn't seem like this list I'm is complete. Kidding. Let's see how many Oculi It only contains right records now. dating back around five years. Let's shift our attention then. Fremenay, okay, so are you able to find anything out? It's the lead up for five years, roughly. <sighs> and follows the heart. Fremenay. That means the enemy was five uh, years ago. Sorry. At least. I was thinking about something. So she's in her uh, early twenties. Talk to quite a few people, but I couldn't help but like if she's in her enemy, let's say house was sixteen. Little... Like she, she looked rather like Strange. sixteen. Maybe. That Strange. means she's twenty-one or something. Yeah, I mean, I know there have been arguments in the past, times when people haven't gotten along. Chaplo and Filial are a good example of that. Oh, those are two of the people have... that we met while delivering supplies. I'm missing 22. I, see they might not get along. They had very I mean, of course, I guess spot on. Their, I'm um, good at this part. Interest Keep in mind, 900 be Detective Cone episodes. I'm good at that shit. That's to be expected, actually. I'm missing 22. Father brought us all here, three, shared her knowledge with us, taught us grand. how to fight. How many do I have more? That's one, one thing two, we all share. Okay, so I have every single but one that's above that's ground. also okay, where the similarities now. end. I can, I can mark off Not some of these already. Not all of us feel the same desire to stay. The ones are above ground As members area. of the House of the Hearth, we're well, also you know I mean considered part of the hmm. Batui. And ground, to a lot of people, that's an identity they never asked for. No. Into Certain members get older and realize they category? want something else for themselves. But considering the rules of the house, <clears throat> most people would never oh, say that out loud. People the funny like part is, Chaplo and Foltz are loyal to father and now vision. that Alecchino is the father, the everything and changed and in the house. On the other hand, like, well, for example, they, they have this big, big rule, right? You These are not betraying like anybody from the family, right? It's not like father is in the dark Before that, it was the like exact opposite. Well, like we are fighting each true. other until one survives. But it just like, feels like things have gotten worse lately. Uh, what's it called? Um, King Phil of the Hill. And like. the others. It seemed like they were meeting in secret to talk about. Something. So it's like the exact opposite. I she absolutely switched sure. everything over. But I think they've met Claire V. You think she's been inciting them to act out? Quick locator. This no, is death. not exactly. Wait, is there a ten but I wouldn't long... be surprised if she said something to them about the darkness in the house and how deep it yeah. runs. She's told me about it before. Okay, it just says new. It has no name. It doesn't have a picture on being it. run on children. People being used as pawns on okay, the battlefield without so much as the strength to survive. Uh, and they the just C believed all that? Without so any I, evidence? I, that one's easy to identify. Like, I have that one. Okay, that's easy to identify. Clarivy's words probably gave them the excuse they were looking I'm, for. I have three down Whether here. Whether they actually believe them to be true so is secondary. Probably just mark all these three off. That's what it seems like. This is all because of Project Stuja, isn't it? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on a second. What's this Project Stuja all about, huh? This is the second time it's come up now. Um, Sorry, I mean, it's, but it's I'm not sure of the details either. Through. I only know what Father has told us, which is that it's something the Rooster and Regrader have been working on together. Apparently, it has to do with the Batui's strategic The Rooster and Regrader. Who was Regrader? I don't remember. Because the House of the Hearth was so I don't even know who Rooster was. The Gnosis, I should check the shit. The Rooster is the fucking short, uh, The Goblin. The short, uh, it's Klee. It's Klee. Isn't that a good thing? It's no, Kali's dad. It's just man. another way of saying dangerous role. So doing for to us, the whole thing is an inconvenience. Father and there's only one so short too, one. This is she's in no position to refuse. Dead. Their plan isn't exactly unreasonable, and they've been funneling the house a lot of funding. It's just I mean, Alice is probably short. We'll lose a lot of members in the process. The greatest Baiju 2.0 are at Pentalone. In the plan. Okay. It's an honor in name only. Refrigerator? I would call him like that. Do Don't give a fuck. Us. Nice. The existence of an intelligence organization he outside Imagine the control he's makes cryo. <laughs> that would be perfect. Everybody would have called him Refrigerator. If not, then I will make it a thing. I don't care. It's these two. Okay, this super complicated top secret for two e business cool. aside. What's all of this have to do with the conflicts you were talking about earlier? Paimon doesn't get the connection. 
external pressure it's kind of funny uh, on how we are now friends with basically everyone of the fucking factory the like they're all our homies People are afraid of dying and that fear is often the impetus for a lot of stupid like, decisions. Who the fuck do you think I you thought are? resolving the like, Clarity oh, yeah, situation would make everything better. Oh, yeah, what up, Denji? But it looks like you it's already more know. complicated than I thought. My little sister, if we leave she's now fishing with me sometimes at Sundays. Yeah, thanks, later, child. I totally wanted to know that. To take action. Yeah. We can only focus on one situation at a time. Everyone's right? still alive, yeah. You're right. Except... Ziggy, even Ziggy got fucked. Fuck Ziggy, good. nobody cares about her. It might even make matters Stupid worse. ass moth bitch. We should focus on Clairvy for now. Well, it's getting late. We should head back and get some rest. We'll try again Signora. first thing tomorrow. Ah. Lynette, you stick with me this time. Yeah, no, fuck you. Yeah, Feminine, fuck Ziggy. Keep a close eye on Filial and the others. No cares. Make sure they don't do Seems anything like they'll regret. Columbina. Good work today, everyone. Have a good night, and I'll see you El tomorrow. El Cocaina Columbina. See, you get it? A nice, I'm now sleeping in the fucking cringe thing again that got yoinked the last time. I'm in search for missing Aki right now. Oh, I'm always looking forward to Which I only night, regret. I don't say that. I... Hey, you don't think the knave will be too angry with Linny and everyone if she finds out about all this, do you? She's even scary when she it's smiles. She's even she scary when she smiles. Oh, you have to protect Paimon if that happens, okay, Traveler? I'm also afraid of her. <laughs> you can't just but I'm just afraid. Oh, well, in that case, we okay, should just plan just on run away. running away. We'll grab Linny and the others and we can make a break for it as fast as we can. <gasps> <clears throat> Clavier oh. just run away. Look over there. <clears throat> Quick, I'm let's catch up with her before anyone sees. Mark it off. I'll come back to it if I'm still missing the AR thing later on in life. Where did she fucking go? Do I have to go up here? I don't know. I mean, flying is kind of fast, but stamina draining is so cringe. It pisses me off. Dude, she just spawned. Your... Yeah, but what does it count though? Because just eat food, problem solved. Nah, man. Fuck that shit. Who do you think I am? Oh, where is she going? <laughs> Bro. Oh, someone sees her, we're toast. Dude, she's just disappearing among the sea of butterflies. Can I fly up? Probably yeah. not. Nope. It would be hilarious if you do the the CSGO thing oh, where you fly up the fucking ladders for no reason. Oh my god, the moon. Clearly! Shh! Open the window while no one was looking. No witnesses. Look how pretty the outside is. Window? <laughs> window? I could have more than this. Okay. He's talking about windows. Oh my god. So Imagine not using Linux. All this hopeless resisting. It's better to dream of what I could have than try to make it a reality, right? Please, help us get on the same page here, Clary. We need you to tell us what you know. Can you do that? Sure. Although... After you hear all this, I think you might regret that decision. I'm not regretting that decision, I'm good. Is nothing mm. more than a tool. The only thing I'm regretting is Something spending so much time on this already. Exploited. Without, we'll like, taking a break all. or anything. Mm, what? Me. As long as the only thing useful, I'm regretting right now is spending so much time on this around. and not taking a break or anything. Lose your value. Yeah. You're handed over to the doctor. Experimented the on. The doctor, oh no. Given a fate worse than death. I've seen it happen again and again, and I've had enough. You're saying the knave did all that? Who? It's just, that doesn't seem like something she would do. Uh, she's scary and all, but it seems like even she has lines she wouldn't cross. Huh. I knew you wouldn't Mom. believe me. Everyone thinks she's a good person. 
They all think of her like a real mother. Mother? 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 But she doesn't deserve that title. She's disgraced it and tarnished it. And if I had things my way, I'd never see her again. If only Perry were here, she'd understand. Yeah, she would understand. Perry. There's that name again. Also, Paimon's getting oh, a strange what? feeling. <laughs> Paimon getting a strange feeling. And it now I see her face and be like, not really fuck who you? here with us. Paimon can't yeah, tell if she's actually you? talking to us or if she's mistaken us for someone else. Hydroculus mm. in total. Well, in any How case, many? it seems like 18. she really needs someone to talk to. 18. What? We should keep her company for a little longer. Huh? She I'm looks so young. But it seems what? like she's been through a lot. Yeah, 18 Oculus. Uh, Dude, I've already found like 40. That makes no sense. Oh, I'm only Isn't 14 times level 10. Oh. Hey. Wanna hear a secret? You're 14 away I from 10. That if you look up at the night yeah. sky in yeah. Naya, you can so, see and that's one more, so that's 15. It's supposed to be and how many do you collect? Pretty. Even prettier than the moon tonight. I don't know. That's the issue. I mean, we all know which knife she's right talking about. Yeah, I know. <laughs> if she's saying mother, it's like. Anime. Well, I have these two. <clears throat> Perry I'm doing right now. I'm checking like where it is on the map. I'm checking older, what I have pinned off. We're gonna go see it together. The Tangelas and the Tangels. I'm worried she's all soupin. No, that wouldn't happen to her. She's special. Okay. Mother I'm likes her a lot. She's special. Oh my God. She's one of those. She has a special needs home. Should really go talk to mother. But we just fought. She doesn't want to see me. And I'm too scared to face her. Here? What should I do? Trixie by this one. Is that to claim it? If I do, I'd mock it off. <sighs> my mom really doesn't Didn't? understand what's going Didn't? on with her. Means my, my well, um, mocking so far back. is correct. We've got an early morning tomorrow. Like, I don't understand. They could have just gotten or gone to Alcino and asked about a Perry. All this right. way, Looks like we're all here. a lot of things Let's would be much easier. But also a little bit more problematic, maybe. Because then we're getting killed. Which is good. Fuck the plot armor. Oh? What is it? Have the knife and the doctor ever work together? What makes you ask that? We kind of ran into Clairview last night, and that's what she told us. We met the doctor back in Sumeru. He's super dangerous, super and dangerous. he's done all sorts of bad things. And we will kill the doctor it's soon, I hope. It's possible that Father and the doctor have had certain dealings, but I don't think Father <laughs> will work with him. <clears throat> We're not really on the same side, so there's not a lot of trust between them. It doesn't but exactly as she wants to get rid of the ghosts and want to... I Protect did until hear, though, that when they know first who she is. Yeah. The doctor offered to work with the House of the Hearth. Father rejected most of his proposals, except for one. It had to do with some sort of secret experiment. Secret experiment? Could that be what Clarvy was talking about? Mm, I don't think so. I don't know any details about the experiment itself, but I do know it's an entirely independent yeah, operation. The doctor only proposed a direction for the research. That was the extent of his involvement. I still don't think that counts as working together. The details of the experiment are confidential, but complete records are kept on all participants. That doesn't seem to be the case with the situation Clairvy referred to. Now I'm back in this position. I know you don't agree with some of the Fatui's like, methods. That's a very weird sentence to say just to. out of the wild, I'm just saying. But I am asking you to trust us on this. It's fine. Don't the context. House of the Hearth has context. its own principles. There are certain lines we're not willing to cross. Oh my god, I'm starting to Alright, that's good to hear at god. least. I'm not pissed off of this. Clairvy they should now ask about Mama. Clairvy and the doctor worked together to do something horrible. Mm. If that turned out to be true, Paimon doesn't know how he would even face you guys. It's just that it doesn't seem like why Kirby is that not kill any of them? That's actually so bullshit. 
The easiest thing to do would be just ask the knave directly, but Hyman doesn't think she'd tell us. I mean, she would kind of if you just ask about mother. Like, there are a few things where you could father didn't come just back ask something night. that would She's make probably sense. probably still near the shore. We'll be counting on you to like, distract her. Why do you call yourself father? Me. Where's the From mother? A, you know what to do. There you go. Be on your guard, Ooh. everyone. Info. All right, let's get to it. Where is mother? What is mother? Why is it not mother? Why are your children motherless? Yeah. Not fatherless behavior, but it's motherless behavior. This is a lot better position than my husband before. <laughs> <clears throat> and now the fun begin. Oh my god, it's happening. I'm flying. The biggest fun I've had in my life. Except when I have no stamina, then it's terrible. Yeah, why the fuck was I so bad with that? Ah, <laughs> oh, it's you two again. I must say, you look a bit pale. Did you have trouble sleeping last night? Yeah, we were chasing a fucking ghost and speaking about mother and whatnot. Perhaps if you had less on your mind, you'd be able to absolve yourself of such troubles. I'm always a big so what bitch. are you planning to do now? Catch up on some sleep? Or should I give you some time to rack your brain for a topic to discuss before I ask any questions? Although I must profess to being curious. Without child here, how do you plan on distracting me? No, of course she knows. Us? Distract Us? you? No. <laughs> A good one. But no, um, we were just here for a chat. Hmm. Looks like you could have used some extra time to think. No matter. If you don't have any other plans, why don't you accompany me somewhere? Oh my god. Don't worry. I'll be sure to steer clear of any scheming children. <sighs> The ocean breeze is sure nice today. The ocean breeze is sure nice today. Oh my god, Paimon, no. <laughs> oh no, the sentence was so good. Holy shit. Children always think they can oh hide my things god. from the grown-ups. But nothing gets past me. Least of all, a little scheming. I think I'll let them have at it for a little longer. Be too much, I can be, be very much. patient. Well, you I'll leave you more. to think things over. If you're so inclined, meet me outside the Palais Marmonia. Good things come to children who do as they're told. So I do hope you decide to tag along. If only for your friends' sakes. Oh my god, she just threatened <laughs> us. Oi, 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 okay. I guess we go there. She clearly knows about everything we've been doing, and Hyman <clears throat> doesn't think it'd be a stretch to say she was threatening us just now. Yeah, that was definitely threatening. I don't know, man. We should release the pigeon that Lily gave us. Probably a bad idea. I'm just saying, that is probably not a good idea. <clears throat> oh, good idea. Hopefully he sees it in time. The thing probably well, dead already. Probably head to the Palais Marmonia. No, the fun begins, yeah. He doesn't want to find out what happens if we don't show up. Based on what the knave was saying just Dude, now, it sure didn't no seem like it'd be anything good. Fucking... Okay, then we probably shouldn't keep her waiting. <clears throat> it seems like Lenny and the I others are on thin ice, so let's do our best to not get them in any more trouble. I want to see how far I can get with that shit. Oh. Okay. Wait. Now let me test it. With a Scaradushi. What do you want from me? I want to see if the range is like... Okay, the range is not as much, but guess what? I have full stamina. So I can get like... Too slow. You know, I tend to live further. Also, keep in mind... <clears throat> he has... Favonis Codex. Okay. He doesn't have his web, like he doesn't have the bonus movement speed. So, yeah. All I can say is, a Wanderer is like a billion times better for Overworld than Alexino in that regard already. 
I mean, it's neat, but it's not good. Maybe I'm just too spoiled. My lance is also, then, like, I have some stamina, I get... Then, then I'm fucked. Like, it's... It's it's hard. Like, if you look at this. Okay? I can't get all the entire water, right? Now I'm swimming. And I'm like... A third. There was like a third, maybe. L less than a third. Probably a quarter, whatever. Same shit. <clears throat> so it's kind of weird. Like, nothing will beat Wanderer. At the current moment, at least. Wait, what is this shit? Seeing as we still have some time before my meeting, we might as well enjoy completed some pleasant quest. conversation wait, while we wait. Wait, I have on Discord the thing now that shows that I have completed children. the quest. Being surrounded by good companions is necessary oh. for a child's actually cool, because of the streaming shit. You're not planning on doing anything to them, are you? No, I'm just kidding. I assume you're referring to Lenny, Lynette, and Fremine. Although... There's that situation with Filial and Nentoy as well. Mm. It appears quite a few people have been acting out lately. Like, how does she even know about Filial no and the other one? I'm not what? one to discriminate. All those who betray she knows the house too much. the same fate. She's spooky. There are no Ew. exceptions. Does that mean you're going to kill them? <clears throat> oh, are you here to beg for their lives? I'm sorry to disappoint, but the rules of the house change for no one. In my organization, everyone is responsible for their own actions. But... Don't you care about them at all? They really respect you! They even call you father! You must feel something for them! You know type flowers? Any organization in which feelings come before principles is one destined for ruin. The House of the Hearth is hardly an exception. You could say our principles are more stringent than most. Perhaps I can offer you this consolation at least. As our guests, you two will not be held accountable along with them. I would imagine Linny, Lynette, and Fremine will be able to keep their lives. As for Filial, Nantoy, and the others, I'm afraid there's little I can do. They can try to escape, but once you know our secrets, there's no getting out alive. My god! Holy that's, shit, that's, that's dark. Awful. Damn. Ah, oh, you seem concerned. Out of consideration for my guests, I suppose I could turn a blind eye for a I'm little sure longer. This one. I'm going around and I can't if find Lily and the others manage to dispose of Claire V in the meantime, all evidence of their wrongdoing oh, yeah. will be lost. In that case, I could hardly punish them for something I couldn't prove. If their efforts are unsuccessful, on the other hand, all will be held accountable. And the punishment will be severe. Of course. Oh, and here. I believe this belongs to you. Oh my god, she got the chicken. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I fucking knew it. It takes a considerable it. amount of time to train a bird like this. It would be such a pity if you were to lose it. Permanently. I fucking Where knew it. I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. Well, I'm afraid that's all the time we have to chat. Now, for the matter at hand. I knew it. I'm so. I asked you to meet me here because I have business at the Palais Mermonia. It has nothing to do with you, but I think it would be prudent for you to stick by my side for the time being. There will always be time later to run off and tell Linny what you've learned. Well, time to go. Looks like we wrapped things up just in time. I'm so good, man. I'm so good at this shit, man. I'm. I should be a detective. I, I. I should be the main character in Salad. Uh, outside this one, I don't know with those two. Those two are so odd. I don't feel like I don't know if I got those two or not. I can't find anything about them, so. I'll have to go to Nubi. Silence! Let the mighty be humble. It's been a while, Monsieur Nervalet. I must say, 
I wasn't expecting my meeting request to be approved quite so quickly. Okay. The Palais Mermonia operates with an efficiency <laughs> worthy of admiration. It is only right that an esteemed diplomat such as yourself should be afforded the proper level of respect. Although, if I may speak plainly, I must confess that I did not anticipate we would have the occasion to meet again after presenting you with the Gnosis. I see you've brought the Traveler and Paimon with you as well. If I may inquire as to the purpose of your visit. I'll be departing Fontaine shortly. There is, however, an outstanding matter that I would like to see resolved before I go. It requires a rather lengthy explanation, I'm afraid. So I took the liberty of explaining everything mm. in this proposal. Please review it at your leisure, Monsieur Nevelet. Mm hmm. Then not. Hmm. I understand your request. However, at the risk of causing offense, I must admit Indeed. that I fail to see why you would wish for such a thing. I heard you have a certain fondness for water tasting, Monsieur Nervalet. So allow me to use water as an analogy. Oh, she a knows about the water. Is like a large body of water with countless rivers well. flowing in and out. As someone who watches over this system, I would hope that each river that flows from the source will eventually reach the ocean. Of course, objectively speaking, I know this is impossible. Most of the rivers will dry up along the way, disappearing into the ground and leaving nothing but a barren riverbed behind. Not all rivers are destined to reach the ocean, but I would not see their existence rendered meaningless. I believe the water that flows within them is simply meant for a different destination, like a field in need of irrigation. Or perhaps the glass well. of a certain water-tasting enthusiast. Um, did you when get any four, of that, five, six. Your six, words paint an optimistic not. picture indeed. Allow me to remind you, however, few among us are willing to sip from a glass filled with tainted water. It may have been tainted at one point in time, but not to worry. I'll make sure it's strained of all impurities and returned to its cleanest form. Hmm. I seem to recall there being a transactional aspect to your proposal. Perhaps you could expound on that? If you accept my proposal, Monsieur Nevelet, I will gradually withdraw my forces from Fontaine. And, Ooh. unless absolutely place. necessary, I, I will no longer carry out any special Seems missions like. within Fontaine. I presume I can take your words to mean that, Wait, in the future, sure. cases similar to the Tartuffe that assassination will sure. cease to cross my desk? Tartuffe? Ah, uh, that thief who embezzled funds from all those charities, you mean? My deepest condolences mm. to his family, yeah, but without any evidence, mm. I cannot imagine how the House of the it? Hearth might have been involved in his passing. Of course, if you accept like my proposal, off. Monsieur Nervalet, oh, yeah. we know I'm about sure that. certain played. measures could be taken to reduce the frequency of such I troubles. You choose your words like motherfuckers and <laughs> one day die left and right, and he's like, your proposal. Oh, I don't remember, well, I don't know, it was me. <laughs> oh yes, it was me. Well... With that settled, we should be going. The one from the animation, yeah. I took the liberty of bringing along two and from bottles the web, of spring water um, from Sejnaya for you to enjoy. I do hope I get the chance to hear your impressions. Perhaps at our next meeting, yes? Indeed. I trust you will not overlook your commitment in the meantime. my brain so much. All right, like, why the fuck Paimon. did you just pull Time to go. off his pearl necklace instead of just taking it off him? Yeah. He died from a certain father stepping on his head. Somewhat, yeah. And then he got robbed by some treasure hoarders and they were like the most unrealistic, idiotic people on planet Earth. <laughs> but it's fine. Step to death by mommy, daddy, father, I don't know. Worth it. Okay, there's one. 
At least he was happy on his last second. Maybe he was gay? So, uh... In that poor man? What exactly were you talking about back there? Paimon only heard you mention some rivers, a large body of water, and then some kind of irrigation scheme. He just hoped that, that he wasn't... And that he enjoyed his you last really final moments. You really want to know. I would imagine there might be more pressing yeah, concerns at the moment. Uh, more pressing concerns at the moment. Paimon really hopes everything's going okay. Yeah, let me see how many I have now. I have eight, oh. but I'm missing 22. Paimon recognizes that look. So you got your ticket cap I'm on, don't you, missing 14. That could be. I'm curious you know, if you get oh. what happens now. Uh, I'm not too sure. Oh, Dude, wait, this text is way too fucking fast. How am I supposed to do that? Oh, okay, nice. We're getting robbed right now. I think I do have all the new um, Hydroculus. Nice, good shit. Because if I go oh, to the old shoot. one, right? The new one. The right? new area. Hmm. I pretty much have everything. I have 99% um, exploration progress. And I'm missing, like, apparently 20 on the overworld, which is, of course, inaccurate. Yeah, that's impossible. But. Oh, jeez. Yeah. I'm so sorry. Must be I was so focused on selling these papers, the I wasn't looking where I was going. Yeah, like, he's lying like crazy. Also, that Scar, mm -hmm. such as shit. Also, he's he has green hair color, so basically you can trust him anyways. Well, let me make it up to you at also, least. Also, it's Here, probably... take this paper. On the house. On the house. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, it's... Ah, uh, yeah. Hmm, a big sky, yeah, I know. It's horror. It, it's a little bit diffy, but... You know what I mean. Oh, you don't have to give us anything. I was thinking about him too. But he looks kind of different because it was a bulky guy on the picture, I believe. The one that was executed, yeah. Please, I want to. I it's not like I'm you. short on supplies. Also... He All the extras will be useless come tomorrow didn't anyway. rob us, he probably gave us something, okay? It's like the exact opposite, most likely. Like, he's giving us that paper, makes no fucking sense, why would he do that? So, the way I see it right now, he either stole something from us, that would be the most obvious part, but maybe he stole something from us and gave us something else. So I assume it could be the fucking pigeon that is that got robbed, because we got the pigeon back, I remember. Um, so I'm r l right now thinking it probably is not like that, okay? But it's, uh, I, I, I don't think I'm, I'm correct on that one, but th there's a chance it's that, okay? Yeah, I, I think I'm overthinking it a tiny bit. It's my fault, really. I was just trying to bring home some extra mora for the family, but... I bit off more than I can chew. Also, I don't think I that there's no accident. Today, I don't so believe I'm in accidents, especially on this show. You don't just randomly run in Fontaine, there are like 10 people on the fucking street, into somebody. That's not gonna be happening. What's going on here? Oh my fucking god, she's pissed. Uh, nothing much. Uh, I just ran into your friend here on accident. I should probably get going, actually, so... How does he know we are friends? That already is sus. He knows too much. He should be killed. Yeah, I guess. Congrats me. Hold on. Hold on. Um, of course, I'm happy to compensate you with Mora. It's just... Oh, I is this why I don't have any on me at I'm the moment. I'm because I already claimed it. Also, he said on the house, which is very giga sauce. I'll take three papers. Here, your payment. Oh, thank you for your patronage. May the Archon's I still have one quest to do in Fontaine I still haven't touched. Amazing. If only I had the chance to run into it's such generous like, um, customers every day. I don't day. know if this will ring a bell, but it's like two <laughs> I dogs. I should probably just take on a smaller too, inventory though, gone, right? Just, like, Wolf, I'm getting married soon, so there. sometimes it's hard to not get ahead of myself. Start doing the anyway. I should head out. Goodbye. Again, what, what do you say I was reading? 
Something two dots. The rest I couldn't hear. My brain was on reading two mode. Dog. Two dogs. Two dogs. It's like... It's like, no, a dog and a cat that looks like Puss in Boots and yeah. a little girl and she wants me to do a quest and I'm, I'm, I'm not even going to At the pier. Right off Paralomonia? Yeah. No, 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 the other one. Um, Orictine or 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 thing. Yeah, Opera. Yes, Opera. Opera sounds good. It's a word I can't pronounce. Opera GX, yeah. It's East of GX. There you go. Have fun. Well, now that my affairs are settled, we should take the boat back to Poisson. We've even acquired some light reading to enjoy along the way. Um... Actually, why don't we... Uh, I guess I could date up, right? Like, that's not too bad when it comes to... Uh, Paimon just realized um, how hungry she is. She can't head back to Poisson on an empty stomach. I wish these fucking crabs would get out of my way so I can do this. It appears you two are under the impression that delaying our return will somehow alter the situation in your favor. Yeah. I'm sorry to ruin Anyhow, your fantasy, anywho. but your efforts are meaningless. Your efforts are meaningless. That being said, I could be persuaded to give Linny some extra time. I just have one condition. Oh no, condition again? If you agree to my request, I'll even answer some of your questions. You're quite curious about Claire V, are you not? And my relationship to her. She was my girlfriend. We were a lesbian couple back then when we were like toddlers. And then she stabbed her fucking self because um, we had to fight but we didn't want to. So she basically killed herself in front of me and died in my fucking arms like a moron. I don't know why. And then I became daddy. Wait, why are you being so generous all of a sudden? Oh, I, 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 ask us to do something bad, are you? I, I have an addiction. New episode of My Strange Addiction. I'm addicted to stepping on people. Yeah. You In a mur with murderous intent. You have to say that together, to otherwise it's just bad down bad instead of bad bad. Malicious intent. Yeah. Uh, then what can you possibly... The most important so consideration the, in a the negotiation stuff came out because I was is so that like, both sides why is Denki not doing the dolphin? <laughs> Demands and threats only get you so. But then I realized that you're on. Oh yeah, it's only Fontaine characters. And I have no fucking Fontaine characters. Wonderful. Here it is. When the time comes, make the choice that you deem most appropriate in the situation, and lend your help to the House of the Hearth. I'm trying to build my Lynette on Four Piece Hunter, but it, it's taking a bit. Okay, sounds normal enough. I have an idea what could what be do you happening. Mean, when the time comes, when is that, is that supposed to be? Yeah. I know when. That's right where so we are at at the battle. That's already known. That's guaranteed to be there. That is for you to decide. Let's go, then we have a deal. Follow me. So We're basically, a, she wants to fight us as well because. She knows that the Lily side of the house of the heart is the important part. Also, why the fuck did I get a mail? What happened? Oh, Baiju's birthday. Nice. Clear water jade. I don't give a fuck. Baiju, you use this piece of shit. Stop giving me useless items I don't ask for, okay? But thanks for your dish. I kind of just want to be done with Fontaine I'm not right really now. Good. Look where we're going now. Into the sunlight. Ah, I guess I can. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> That's very quick. We get to choose very shortly, I guess. Yeah, I have that one. I literally just want to swim past there. Uh, that once it gets to. Next thing. I'm dumb as fuck, I have to go up. Wait, this flower. Die. Yes, okay, the both here. I don't care about you, whopper boy. Gather! Yeah. Yeah. 
Cheery is just too OP, man. I can't even fucking set up. Also, look at my ping. I have 11 ping right now. Chris, do you see that? 11 ping while streaming. I mean, yeah, now it's on 19, whatever. Same thing. 12. There you go. It's legit just these morons being using my fucking internet. How dare they? Fucking neighbors. I should kill them all. That was pretty bad. I mean, that's so shit right now, but it's fine. She'll get better. I mean, that's the fun part about Lynette. She's not getting better. I mean, E4 and E6. Oh, I guess, yeah. You can call that getting better? I would say it is. Because I will because now I'll be able to run, run her as main DPS. Why not? Okay, it's She's happening. No, no, the good part of the story starts. What is this place? Somewhere long forgotten by everyone. It used to be a grand building. Let's get now it's nothing more than a pile of rubble. Uh, Hydro Arculus. All this like destruction just because Daddy was a little bit angry. No one comes here anymore. Nor does anyone care about what once happened this, here. This one, pure Although, right there. This place does have something um, to do with the story I'm about to tell you. Not count. Now we get actual It was victory. before I became a harbinger. And Ooh. before Linny and the others joined the House okay. of the Hearth. Due to certain events, I first like killed Clairvy and then her mother. Oh, she... Okay, and never mind. This is where it all I thought happened. she killed herself. Because it was like rumored, because... Like she still had her weapon in the hand and she was stabbed, so two weapons, what the fuck? But I guess it was just oversight maybe. You were the one that killed Clearvy? Patience now. Maybe Allow me to explain Clearvy's side of the I story first. Did, I'll start it. from the beginning. Clairvy was six like years bit. old when she was brought by her Probably mother, did. Crucibina, to live in the house I'm of the heart. Of From the outside, it seemed like a fairy tale. A thriving family made up of kind adults and friendly children. Crucibina was the knave at that time, and the house of the hearth was under her control. She was Clairvy's mother by blood, but she was also the mother to all the children in the house. Clairvy was happy here, for a time. For a time. But she quickly realized that being part of this family wasn't a fairy tale at all. It was a kind of purgatory. <clears throat> purgatory? Exactly. The House of the Hearth takes in war orphans from all over to Vat. But as for how to raise them... That depends entirely on the person in charge. Crucibina came up with a novel idea. She would teach the children to fight, force them to duel each other, and then crown as the king of the house the child who proved themselves most worthy of inheriting her title. It's difficult to so estimate king of the, the number of children who died or were maimed in the process. There's little I can say about the ones who died. Ones that emerged with permanent injuries, on the other hand, well, they still served a purpose. Think so? They would be handed over to the doctor to be experimented on, or sent away on dangerous missions. Nothing more than tools to be used and then discarded. So those were the experiments Clairvy was talking about. But what actually happened to her? You said that Clairvy was Crucibina's daughter, <clears throat> so if Clairvy tried to convince her to stop what she was doing, Crucibina probably would have listened, right? No. Despite being Clairvy's mother, Crucibina cared little for her daughter. She forced Clairvy to join the House of the Hearth only as a means to demonstrate her own impartiality mm -hmm. as a mother, to prove that she treated all her children equally. Clairvy Damn did try cold. to convince her mother to change her ways, but off. it was to no avail. 
After her efforts failed, the only other this why she got rise up and try to fight these back. Bound wounds as well. Unfortunately, the other children had already been thoroughly indoctrinated into the illusion of happiness Crucibina had created. Okay, um... How much course, do I need to check for? There was one oh exception. Someone Clairvy's uh, age right who now. knew the truth about the House of the Hearth. Her name was Perouere. Petty. Wait, the friend that Clairvy mentioned? I think I was on. I think I already got that one. At the end of the broken water highway. Friend, huh? I like how they call it a I water highway. I suppose we can call her that for now. Clairvy was a cheerful and passionate person with a tenacious spirit. Perouere, on the other hand, was rather cold-blooded. It still is cold-blooded. Her cold-blooded nature allowed her to see through Crucibina's facade. Yet, it was also this cold-bloodedness that prevented her from acting against it. At least at first. While Clairvy longed for freedom, Perouere was convinced that, amid all the fighting and violence, she would make it until the end. Despite their differences, the two became fast friends. United by their knowledge of the truth, Clairvy told Perouere that she hoped to create a real family, where no one would be killed or sacrificed. There may have been a certain naivete to her ideas, but Clairvy proved her determination many times over. She tried countless times to run away, ask for help, or expose the truth. But her efforts only earned her beating after beating. The only thing that kept her going was her strength of will. Even with her body racked with pain, she would still stand on her tiptoes and open the window at night. She and Perouere would look out at the moon together, a fierce longing for freedom shining in her eyes. But one day that light simply vanished. Oh no. What happened? Her hopelessness resulted from a culmination of things. Ten years had passed. Ten years worth of failure after failure. She and Perouere weren't children anymore, but finding any chance to escape still seemed as hopeless as ever. Not gonna lie. I like tune in that age looks absolutely fucking amazing. Better than right now. I'm not gonna lie, man. Like, from the drip. And the hair, everything. It just looks, I, I don't know, it looks better, I would say. But maybe just because it's the white side and not the, That sounds so bad, man. That sounds so bad, but I'm gonna say the black side. It was during this time that Perouere suggested a new plan. If escaping Jesus. was out of the question, oh, no. why not take down the very person I'm German, sitting after all, on it's top normal. of this throne of lies? True. Is this Mother out, out herself. Now? Took a while. Clairvy rejected that proposal. She claimed that, as a famous harbinger, Crucibina possessed an unimaginable amount of power. Trying to kill her would have an incredibly low chance of success. And then the enemy hidden? Oh Clairvy my God. never gave another reason, but Perouere could see it written all over her face. Clairvy still thought of Crucibina as her mother. Killing her own flesh and blood was a line she couldn't bring herself to cross. She's good-hearted, man. If Clyder. she couldn't escape and fight back, then only one option remained. Precisely. Death okay. was the only way that she felt she So she necked it. Okay, good. Fair. It happened during a duel. When she arrived at the dueling ring that day, her partner turned out to be none mm -hmm. other than Perouere. The very person that had stood by her side all those years. It was a fierce battle. But ultimately, Clairvy decided to let Perouere end her life. Oh, okay. From that moment on, Perouere's journey was one written in flames. When the rain finally came and washed it all away, there she stood, the sole victor in Mother's endless game of slaughter. A trail of corpses strewn across her path to success.
It was the very result she had predicted ten <clears throat> years prior. Even then, she believed she would make it until the end. She wasn't surprised by the fact that she emerged as Mother's undisputed heir. Rather, her success left her with an inexplicable sense of restlessness. She was unsettled. Hey, I get it. And there was only it. one thing Jeez. that could quell that sensation. Perhaps you two would like to take a guess as to what it was? Her Sabini, you mean? But... But... Yeah, yeah, Paimon. The lines, connect them. She's Perry the Platypus. Correct. She's Perry the Platypus. This is the place where Periware killed her best friend. Okay, so a mere year later, been. this is also the place where she fought oh, oh, yeah, tooth and way, nail to, to kill Did the you mother ever they shared. How the hell you get this activated? What? Do you know how you get that activated? What? Um, there's like this little tiny hideout next to this big mountain in next to like the water cubes in. Do a screenshot. Um, it's part of something study. Just give me a screenshot. With a screenshot, I can work. Without a screenshot, I cannot work. I, I need visual, okay? Uh, where are you? Here. Hello. So you know where I am? Come a little bit quicker. I need my story, please. Hello. I'm starting to forget shit. I have Alzheimer's. Where am I? Who am I? Ah, this shit. Um, you need... Um, there are these auras, okay? I think there are seven of them. You have them in your inventory, probably. Um, you should check in your inventory. Um, then after you've gotten all of them, you go Biggest underground a little bit to the west of your location right now. There's underground, like this big-ass furnace place. Do you remember that? If you go to the boss area, to the um, horse boss, to the south, right? Uh -huh. There's like some, like, big-ass fucking furnace. If you have, I think it was seven of these weird aura, you go there and you merge them to fucking gather and basically blow up the entire fucking place more or less. And after that, you get a key or some shit and you use it there on that red thing. Okay. I don't know how they're called anymore. I got the fucking... I got the combination of it, like you know the um, like when when all the things are fused together. Yes. I have that. I'm just so I guess that's where I am in the quest. Yeah, I and guess. then and then you go to the red thing and just use it there. I don't know where the fuck the red thing. I don't. I don't have it. It's it's don't like on it. dude. It's on your screenshot on the left. Yeah, but it won't let me. Yeah, then you ha don't have it. It's that simple. I have this. No, I have the um, the cluster of the ore. Oh. When all seven of them fuse into one. Okay. Yeah, but but you didn't fuse it. I mean, you have seven and put them together, but you have not um, combined them yet. And that really? is in the furnace place. I can't open the map right now, so yeah, just go to the to the horse boss, okay, underwater the thing, the electro one, and go to the south and follow the path there until you get to a big round place, okay. It has multiple layers, but it's just basically one big plateau where you do something on, okay. The moment she acted, any conception uh, of what was right or room. wrong ceased to matter. It's a little bit to the west of your place right it's now. It's one of the principles of the house. In the ocean, only just go under, on the water teleport, then you see it automatically. It only has one height. There are no different heights, I believe, at that location. Paraware won the battle the and became a harbinger herself. After which her majesty, the Tsaritsa, bestowed upon her a new name. Arlequino. Hello, Perea. So the Perry Clairvy was talking about... It was you all along. You're Perrywear. Arlequino is just a name you got later. I left oh, that own. name behind long ago. I must say... Hearing it now does bring back memories. After I defeated Crucibina, 
The moniker of Mother died with her. I chose to forego the title she called herself and even chose to give up my own no, name. Tell me I, go back to that I rebuilt fucking, uh, the House of the Hearth under a new identity. There? Not only as Arlecchino, but as father. And that I wish I had two is charges. where the story ends. I see one more Lynette. Any more questions? Yeah. Based on what you just told us, Clarvy wasn't a little kid when she was killed. So the Clarvy we met... Was she really a spirit at all? I suppose you could call her an illusion born of flame. Her existence is like ashes to okay. a fire. Something left over in the wake of blaze and ruin. I'm like dying. You see, a certain power runs through my veins. It's not unlike a curse. My flames leave behind shadows of anything they consume. Ooh, okay. Uh, of course. I'm missing the nine. Of those like shadows nine more morphing into a sentient was. entity. Are and I know where one of them is, slain. so it's technically I need to check it. Eight Clearly, more. is a very special case. I might be able to finish my hydro. Clarvy died today, when she was God. 16 years old. Mm -hmm. But what emerged from the flames was her six year old self. Her appearance actually said wasn't 16. the only oh thing God, affected. So good. Most of her memories were lost to the blaze as I'm well. So good, man. I should be detective. What I'm doing even here, man? Mysterious thing indeed. Losing a portion of your memories will alter your sense of self. I was 17 when she killed. Lose 10 was she? Years worth I mean, yeah, true, it was one year later, and now five years, so it's 22. Like living in the past. Like returning to a But good, I didn't have that information that it was a year later Never. after killing her. Like we just saw from the anime that both fights happened. But I know in between was a time skip. I, I realized that one. Just we didn't know how much it was. But... What? I said I mean she went to jail. I mean, yeah. <clears throat> no wonder Paimon got such a weird feeling when we were talking to her. I mean, I saw that there was definitely a difference. Like... She she looked different. There there was definitely some time between the first kill and the mother kill. I thought it was right after the Clary situation. Yeah, I thought so too at the start, but I, something kept me at something's weird here. Maybe she just um kept her wounds like like fixed that shit and whatnot, and maybe changed some clothes and then and then went to mother and fought her okay I, I knew that something was different i knew there was a time switch around right but i don't know how, how much it was but i mean they just said it's a year so we actually know exactly that she's 22 so that's fair then no? perhaps i should put it this way oh, I think this is it. claire v is it someone it. trapped in time it may seem like she exists with us <clears> in the present <throat> But she truly lives in the confines of her own past. So if all of that is true, then you must have known about Clarvy for a long time. Indeed. She's a rather volatile and unstable entity. Sometimes she would look after the children. She's even saved some of their lives. But... Other times, she would hide from me and become obsessed with revealing the truth about the house to anyone who will listen. <clears throat> I mean, it's the old truth, not the new truth, I guess. Shadows don't have the capacity to learn or grow. <clears throat> Any new information they encounter is quickly forgotten over time. Your attempts to expose Clairvy to sunlight, they failed, yes? The reason is actually quite simple. In Clairvy's mind, the house is impossible to escape. Is it poor Venti again? And it is this very perception that traps her there. But 
No matter. All I have to do is kill her again, and all will be resolved. I don't anticipate so much as a single speck of ash will be left behind this time. Well, I'm going to put my gadget too because I don't like this. It's kind of surprising that she can actually do that to a spirit. That's pretty surprising. What? I kind of don't believe it. I'm honest with you, but I mean, it's 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 Genshin. There's a possibility. Paimon can understand why you might want her gun, but isn't there another way? I mean, you can call an exorcist, Paimon. Okay. I don't think that's going to be helping, but... So what if she's trapped in her six-year-old self? She's I mean, I guess you can, break. but Have again, to her first? isn't really going to help. Hmm. It's too late for that. She broke the rules, and now she must be punished. That goes for filial and mentor you know, as well. Okay, seen she said quite the effect so the on them. Is normal. Okay. I hope you understand. The difference between Crucibina and myself lies in our formulation of the rules, no, I'm a not big our rock policy in there. for enforcing them. Upholding the rules without question is a trait we both share. Because that is how a household should be run. What? What do you say? So now my big rock in there. Good shit. I like rocks. <sighs> is there any chest down here, or is it just that one hydroculus? Wait, 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 wait. Lumine just did. Hmm. I think she's about to speak. Bold prediction. Is this really what you want to do? I'm so good. I should be a detective once again. Whatever could you mean? Oh my god, Traveler speaking. Oh my god, Traveler speaking. Trevor spoke, oh my god, that means VA gets money for once in her life. And he, I mean, then again, you just want to stroke your ego? Nah, man. Don't you want to say a proper goodbye at least? I like Lou means VA. It's so fucking sad you cannot speak that much. Just like the good boys. Whether as a killer or as a father, there are two things that must be avoided at all costs. Anger. And sorrow. That is true. If you want to kill somebody, you shouldn't be angry, otherwise, you just fuck up. Simply as that. You mean voice very sick? Anger makes you impulsive. Sorrow causes you to waver. See, told you. Also, shit, webcam bullshit. Fuck, wait, I have to open my browser. Uno momento. What? You told me what? I told you nothing. Map game. No, you said I told you so. If I'm, if oh. I'm confused, who you're talking to and what? I'm curious. I don't know. Dude, I, I already forgot my Alzheimer's man. But Ethan, I don't know. It feeds off mostly of the time. I mean, it's just a female Diffy. I guess. Women are just better at I mean, speaking, okay? Who is it? Ether and Lumine. No, I'm talking about who. Who is who is who are you talking to? Chris. Okay, okay. I make sure it's not Sonya because if, it was, if it, you said female Diffy and when it's Sonya, I'd be like, nah, it's just Sun. Just mentally ill. I mean, don't worry about it. That that would be completely Diffy. <clears throat> I regret picking Ether. A lot of people do, but then again, a lot of people I don't regret apparently it. regret picking Lumine, picking Lumine, and I don't understand why. I'm honest with you. Because I'm sorry to tell you, but technically speaking, he is the real main character. You're the Lulu. And when I and, and having her on EU account so far, I I just it just doesn't feel right. Just so off. Everything about your fucking face feels off too. Yet still it exists. I wish you could change it. Man, it would somewhat so make sense, but I don't know. What? You're in so much copium. Nah, man. It's you that is like coping hard. No, literally. No, literally. He is supposed to be the main character. He is. He's the actual main not. character. The two. Yes, he is. Dude, you're so delusional. Dude, me and you said it like a billion times before that it, they are both the main character. There's no. Yes, they're quote unquote both the main character, but what trailer have you seen with actually Lumin being the one that's with Pyron? Never. It's always Ether with Pyron. And. I think there were a few Lumine ones as well, but yeah, they usually use Ether just because I don't know why. But it's literally both. 
Otherwise, web events and all the shit would only have ether and not both. I mean, the thing is, it no, it, on dude. Because it, no, because I since I pick ether, I get ether on my web events, but you get with me on yours. It seems like it's that one stack. One, one second. Was three years ago. When was that? Yeah, that was before the game even really was old. I mean, now nah, the game was old already, but not that long. Oh, uh, where I'd have to find it? Like, there is a post. Just to find it. Like, it was official from Genshin Impact Death. Genshin, who is the true main character in Genshin Impact? There we go. It's the same. No, it's not the same shit. There was. Man, if I could find it, man. The Genshin Impact player has found a detail potentially proving that Lumine is the game's true main character. There is no true main character, once again, but still. If I only could find the shit, man, I don't know what to Google for to find it. But basically, both are. Quite easily. Me even said it themselves. I just can't be asked to find it. Wait one second. I mean, I guess I'm I'm getting alarm clock. That's fine. Well, it appears it's about time to proceed. Before we arrived, I told some of my well-behaved children to bring our troublemakers here by nightfall. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Time for the battle. I do believe I've kept my end of the deal. I give your friends quite <clears throat> a bit more time. As for what happens now, we'll just oh, have the to The music starts. See. Why don't you take his blocks? Okay. I'm not ready. My, my team is not good for that shit. But then again, I guess I'm getting a promo team or some garbo. Here they are, father. Oh, okay. And the little bitch in the fucking shadow, man. The cutscene will be safe. Oh my god. If there's a cutscene, I kinda have to close my browser again. Fuck, man. Because otherwise, it's leggy as shit. What if I close just every fucking tab? Ah, oh, you gonna execute him? Seeing something like that would actually be a first for me. Oh my god. Execute? Wait, what? Hey. No. No. I'm sorry. I heard about how you helped buy us more time. The fanboys and the fairy will die. Amazing. I, I still failed. I couldn't find a way to fulfill her wish. Huh? Warren, take his box. Here's Are you with the... Perry? Why don't I take? Yes, it is Perry. Indeed. Perry the platypus. It's been a while, Clarify. Can I open this? Perry! Or something? Perry. The pet. Shh, shh. Stay right there. I'm yeah, sorry to postpone our reunion, but first, I believe certain scores need settling. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Please don't, don't tell me it's leggy. If it's leggy, I'm gonna be pissed, man. Father, let me explain. Out of my way. Oh, Father! She's balding? Oh no. Oh no, it's Jova. You chose to conceal a threat to the house. And for that, you must be punished. So emergency drain. Overall, however, I suppose your wrongdoing is hardly the most egregious of the bunch. So I'll deal with your punishments later. As for right now, um, the more pressing concerns are the traitors among us. Let me like, 
Okay. okay. I'm oh, I'm looking carefully. Oh, There's a lot of water. There's a lot of water. <clears throat> I mean, they're a couple, man. Look at them. They bang. Like, they already have children. They're probably They're probably brother and sister at this point, man. Father, let me explain. We didn't mean to... Fultz. Fuck, I pressed the button again. Yes, father. Secret midnight meeting number three. Participants, Filial, Nantoy, Sato, Tadi. What a fucking snitch! Kill the snitch, man. Look, there's this little piece of shit. I would kill him because he's snitching. Nantoy clearly said, if only father wasn't the one who took us in. Is there any more water? Is that what I need? Sato added, I'm sick of this life. I just want to live as a normal person. Why didn't I activate the cooling system, though? Oh, this pyro. Filial was the worst of them all. She called us crazies and said a bunch of mean things about father. That's why. I mean, crazies? Yeah, that's fair. I mean, you're fucking crazy. That's be fucking weird. You're doing fucking death potions. And teaching stealth techniques, man. What is wrong with you, little shit? I did not! Also, yeah, that, that's... Yeah, the, the bad things about father? I don't remember that shit. I would have remembered. You're... You're lying! Fultz is trying to frame us! The first part, yes. They call them crazies, but... To be fair, they kind of are. So... I, I give them that. It's not like I'm the only one who heard those things. After that, you and Toddy and a bunch of other people started talking about Clairvy. You were using all those Is things Clairvy brought up as an excuse to question father. But it's not father, it's mother. That's the entire thing. We didn't see the secret meetings. The secret ones not, no. But we know about her calling them crazies. The secret meetings, we don't know shit about. That's okay, yes. Out of the open, can't judge We're that birds shit. Locked in a cage. The only way out is to destroy it. Are you telling me there's no jellyfish here? That's what you issue? said, wasn't it? Are you telling me I have to use the fucking... I, I want to punch this little fucking snitch so badly. You little... You just want me gone, don't you? What did I ever do to you, huh? And you, Shaplo. Have you forgotten who stood by your sickbed, watched over you, and changed your dressings? Come on, let's hear it then. What's your reason for all this? I think the little fuckwad is blackmailing this bitch ass too. It wouldn't surprise me. Like he has his fucking balls in his and he's crunching them. Like this little shit. You're wrong, I don't trust him. I don't trust this solution. He has green hair. You can't trust him. There's no way. We don't want you to green die. Hair, not, no You're trust. our family. Liar. You wouldn't be yeah. doing this nah, if man. that were the case. This guy's guy nerd. So why? Why have you backed us into a corner? We all live in the What's house of the thing? hearth. You know the type of work we do, Phil. What's the we to do? A single not a betrayal magician. can cost dozens of us our lives. <coughs> it's not like it's never happened before. That kind of thing is hard to forget. So do this. Yeah, why is it getting stuck? That's why the house of like, the why does it get stuck on those stupid shit? I'm actually getting so pissed off Ever by since this. we came to Poisson, you've had seven secret meetings. A lot of the things you talked about was? really crossed the line. So I'm in the place. I'm in Ever the since we now came to Poisson, do. you've had seven secret meetings. The fuck? Seven? I call bullshit on that. You've been spying on us when for half a week? month? Wait a second. No, she, oh, she knows. Now half that month. I think about it, Every two days, the Gushet. move to Poisson was just a way to make it easier to spy on us, wasn't it? Because we were all in one place. You've had this planned all along. Hey, you. Filial Nantoy, I'm sorry. I owe you both my life. I owe Claire V too. If it weren't like, for I'm all so your confused. help after I got poisoned, wait, okay, there you are. I'm standing here today. I'm so confused with the fuck you all. You fucking prick. If this were any other situation, I would do anything to repay oh my that God. kindness, even if it cost me my oh life. Oh my God! But <sighs> rules are rules. Swear to this game, I'm sorry. Literally, give me brain My hands are tied.
That's enough, Filial. We made a mistake. Bitch. I literally told you to, to go right here. Why the we fuck the are you rules. going a lot closer Plain to me than what you actually simple. are supposed to? And now we have to face the consequences. I'm sorry, Chaplot. Mm. Faults. Hey. I'm sorry, there Father. Jeez. We <laughs> accept <laughs> our punishment. And it's not like can run away. <laughs> According to the rules of the House of the Hearth, how should these traitors be punished? All those who betray God, the house already. pay with their lives. Hardly a crest, it's just a bitch. And so it shall be. <laughs> Execute them! Kill them all! Burn the witch! And, oh kill the, and kill the fucking green haired shit, please. I beg you. Father, please wait. I still I'm want him dead. I'm actually going to choke someone, I swear to God. Choke the little kid here, please. Something you want to say, Linny. Oh my God. Linny, you're... You're stretching it a tiny little bit, okay. Please reconsider, Father. What Filial and the others did. Does it really count as betrayal? Can this thing just break already? We all come from broken families. From the very first day we joined the House of the Hearth, we wanted nothing more than Thank to make it God a real home. Broken. Holy shit, that felt like it took 10 years. But the truth is, none of us know what a real home should look like. Then you have a point. I'm not saying I have all the answers. All I know is this. Killing Filial and the others may uphold the rules, but doing so will only bring us further away from being a real family than we've ever been. So please, Father, please reconsider. I agree with Winnie. Oh, nice. Father, Arch please. Oh my god, all oh, three. Oh no. No fucking wonder you're dying. You morons. You fucking Linny, idiots. Linny is a homie, I'm just saying, but nah, man. He's fucking killing himself right now. Idiot. I also agree with Linny. The gay homie. <sighs> oh no. Oh, oh no. She said dot dot dot. If she's saying no, 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 no. It's over. It's over for them all, man. Order, she would kill everybody. Cannot be rescinded. No survivors. No witnesses. However, <laughs> she's like Santa Claus. Yeah, I mean she does it as well. I so. suppose no. we shall have to go about this a no different way. No witnesses. Draw your weapons and face me. This doesn't know what the fuck we're talking about. Draw your weapons and face me. That, 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 that's a good one. Um, I didn't see that one before. You, that's... Our weapons? <clears throat> yeah, your bow. Dude, I, it's level 60. That's good enough, right? Lenny, hello? Like, you're stacked, right? Webcam bullshit in one minute, I have to wait. Father, are you referring to a duel? It's not a hey, duel. Hey, now I just got a... I just got a, um... A, uh, crystal thingy, but it's purple this time. So I'm assuming Correct. that's what I need. Probably, yeah. I'm just trying to get the Alkali, man. I just want to be <clears throat> done with, with, with Fontaine. 30 seconds. After that, before I'm so doing more. So the duel is a slaughter, pretty much, yeah. The thing is, according to the trailer we saw, Remini somehow, this little fanboy shit, with his dog shit fucking Claymore, parried one of her attacks. And I'm like, what? What's wrong with him? How are you? What? Like that motherfucker's cheating. Cheater? I mean, I guess he has the bell, which is H with the bell. Yeah, I mean, it's a bell. Like, it has shield, right? It, it's HP, right? So it makes sense. You that, could be a golden artifact, but it's shit. I mean, the, the bell has like the 10 out of 10 drip. 
just a zero out of ten fucking usability. But that's a, that's not my problem, okay? I mean, it's it's usability there just because he's gonna need that shield. Also, I can close my browser now. So let's go, father. The rules of the house will not be altered. Traitors must be punished. I like how Lumi is like. Is looking. And Paimon is like, hmm, that's cool. Why the fuck are we even in here? Can we please go home already? I don't want to see this shit. However, resolving disputes with a duel is also one this of is our rules. This one that seems like also applies family matters. to me. I think we should go. Demonstrate a sufficient showing of strength. And I shall offer a concession. Wait. Beat. Beat. Father in a duel. Father in a duel. You promised Arla to help the house? Yes. And, I mean, she fucking is like, I don't know, time traveling with some garbage. Impossible. Like she knew. Father is way too strong, even for Linny. Dude, Linny is not that strong. I mean, he's a fire star character, but. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. <laughs> no. <laughs> not against the Alex Chino. That's a different world. I can't give you a fucking golden feather for golden troop, but it's so shit for me. At least mine was shit. It's time. Level 60 bow. Let's go, baby. The bell. Let's go, baby. Okay, oh my god, he's a card. He throws cards. He's like Yugi. How many I have now? No. Wait, she has the weapon I have. I, I gave her. Wait, wait. And he has bell? Right, right? Did, it, did, I, did I see bell? My fucking god, man! My e my eyes. Oh no! Lin and the others have to do the game. Now. What should we do? Can they really win something like that? No, man, they can't win. I know my builds for them three. That's not going to be happening, man. I mean, Lynette has maybe a chance to survive, but that's about it. I don't have a chance. I'm done. If they lose, those people from the house are really going to be executed. <clears throat> hey, are you listening? That's actually really good. Holy shit! Wait, that's actually really good for me. You mean it's like okay? All the ones I need to check. Like, I already I, I can see into Lumine's mind. She's like, okay, how the fuck do I get rid of the corpses? <laughs> how do I get fucking rid of them? I have a problem. Luminlet will think I was yeah. fucking doing this shit. This is not good. Fuck, how do I get rid of the corpses? She's like, where are pigs? I need pigs. Pigs will eat them. I just need to get rid of the team. First, that playable characters. Yeah. Is executing him really what she wants? Now she wants to test them. Don't you want to say a proper goodbye <clears throat> at least? Anger makes you impulsive. Sorrow causes you to waver. This was Ooh, looking at right? that expression on her face, she seems really serious yeah. about this. Guess that oh means my there's God. no chance she's throwing the duel on purpose, huh? The thing is, considering her hands are constantly black, she's like in constant sorrow, I guess. Because I think it was sorrow or sadness. Sadness, let's go. Yeah. Be sad. There's no way the knife will lose on purpose. Although, nah, no, man, that's not all though. It's Joba. Give up. Behavior. And any disputes are less likely to escalate. No, wait, wait, wait. I have a question. For, um, Wanderer, right? Yes. Is him running... I did not understand a single um, word. You just crashed again. Set, the Wanderer. Yes. Is his signature set? Yes. Or is Mera Chasse Hunter better for him? His signature set. Hunter can be good, but Hunter forces him into a weird position where you can only use him with Farina, otherwise he's unplayable. Because he will never get the thing up. Because he needs a shield, so he's not taking any damage. <clears throat> but Hunter okay, Hunter is very competitive just by default on every character, but the problem is you always need Farina in the team, otherwise it's not working out. Hmm. Well, guess what? I get to not care about that since I'm doing you, Lynette. Because Lynette drains her own HP. Yeah, but 
I mean, yeah, okay, she heals as well, so it's fine. When the time comes, make the choice that you deem most appropriate in the really situation. And to lend that? your help to the House of the Hearth. Basically, what Alexino said is, yeah, bitch, fight me. What's wrong, Traveler? Hey, where are you going? She's just walking. The ghetto walk. Yes, my game is lagging. Traveler? Nice, with all the fucking trusty... Dumbass weapon that is like fucking level one, one star. I mean, he has his weapon, but I think uh, he has a different weapon for me right now. She has her weapon. She actually has that one right now. And Luni has fucking cards. The heart of the car. I guess I'll see you go. I would like to see way. myself what the fourth of the harbinger that we can do. You are asking to join the duel against the knave? Yeah, boy! Blood armor, baby! Let's beat that bitch up! I'll allow it. We do have a ready-made dueling ring at our disposal, after all. All I would advise is this. Keep a firm grasp on your weapon, and give it your all. Any less. And you may just lose your life. I have to take off my sweatshirt. I'm dying otherwise. I now understand where. Okay. It's in here. It's it's time to battle. It's time to do 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 duel. <clears throat> time to get my ass beaten. Nice. Do I at least have a decent team or do I have that fucking Alex Chino team? Because then I'm fucked, I can give up on life. Uh, probably not that. I mean, do you have Shiori on it, on the team? Yes. The thing is, I don't think Seems Shiori alone can do it. I'm scared in that current battle. Oh my. Oh no! <laughs> oh no, it's a team! Oh no, I have Mika! You know I have Mika! Oh no. With the fall of darkness, destruction shall rise. Have a taste of purgatory. Oh, it's not even me. <laughs> I was like, where the fuck would she go? Oh shit! Oh my god, we got help. Oh my god! What the fuck is happening? Where is she? Okay. okay. I got two out of five that I needed. Or six? I don't know. Wait, that. Oh my god, the spider webs. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Oh no. Nivy knows. Oh no, Nivy knows. He saw that shit. He was like, oh my fucking god, it's Jova. Cinder of the two worlds. Ooh. Oh, Ooh. oh no. Oh my god, I should have had Lumina in the fucking team. My blade is all that remains. Stabilize. Now for chips. Over here. I mean, the fight seems pretty easy, I would say. And now third place or what? That makes... No, never mind. It's just animation. Oh my god. Ooh! Okay. 
said card games on motorcycles. Something like that. No, Fremini is just a giga shit. Dude, Fremini is so fucking OP. Holy fucking shit, the bell. You should know better than to crack the thing is place. swirling, swirling ages. Oh my god, no fucking way. <clears throat> I mean, just take a HP scale that can't take, that can't deal damage, and there you go. That was actually oh, decent on them. No! But I don't think that I don't think he's like this. I'm sorry, father. Oh shit! Oh my god, and there she's staying. Oh my god, with fucking hands. And now she does that one, right? Sorry for what? The, 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 the clapping one. Like the, the, the classic enemy thing. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. I just knew it. Oh my god. Stabby stab. But not really. Just chokehold. It's like basically force him to surrender. Yeah, the little shit is crying. Yeah, die, no, little no. fuck one. Oh my god, I have to plot armor again, as always. Made it out, did you? <laughs> You're stronger than I expected. I mean, yeah, we had that serum from. That shit's, that shit's spooky. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no 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 no! Oh no! We in the sp in the spooder web. It's over. Nothing personal, kid. And then also have one barrel. You passed the test. Still, not strong enough to beat me. God damn! Okay. What the fuck happened? My... Oh, no. Oh, no, man. Man, I just hope I get to finish fucking... She basically humbled us. She humbled us like fucking crazy. Okay, yeah. She's like, yeah, nah, man. M maybe next time. Have fun. Keep trying. Lemao loser. El plus ratio. <sighs> I believe we can end things here. Dude, it's the first time we actually lost it's not the fuck what? We get to enjoy the company of guests but, after all. But we were at mercy. We wouldn't want things to get too out of hand. <clears throat> hey, Corpio didn't jump off with Kazuma. <coughs> Second time again. I mean, not really. I mean, first time was basic. Okay, first time was a scattered douchey on Yai thingy, I believe. Against Raiden, eh, that's. I mean, yeah. I mean, so what? Thomas saved us. I mean, he didn't really save us, I guess. Um, we were like in her fucking, in her fucking room, in a fucking gamer lobby. But also, I would not consider that one really a loss, uh, because I don't know. I just wouldn't, because it was. It's it's hard to explain. What I would consider loss is basically where we were fighting against Wanderer. Fighting against, against Wanderer, okay. Um, in Inazuma, where Yai gave the Gnosis to him. That that was where we lost. That's where we basically, we, we got fucked, okay. We got literally outplayed and we lost. That one, I would say, that's where we lost. Okay, we okay, lost against Scaradouche boss 168 times as well. But that's something different, <laughs> according to Kusa Dotali. What? Technically, according to my map, I should have every single Akiwai now. But you don't. But I'm one off. Do you mean you're one off from level max level, or are you one off because you are max level and you need that one bonus one? Um, both. <laughs> okay, then you're two off. Because that's always a bonus one, right? Without Toma, we would be dead. I don't know about Toma one. I'm not too sure. I don't remember that. It's too I long ago. Also, we lost more than 100 times against Godscar. Yeah, 100. 
68 times. Do you know why you know that number? We need exactly these many of flowers, for example, for Alec Chino. It's exactly that number. It's it's kind of fucking hilarious. They took exactly this number. 168. Brother, are you all right? Brother, are you all right? Yeah, sister. Lenny. Ask me two, so I can find the last two. I need Coke, man. The drink. I mean, I guess. I don't remember. Given that I, I am the victor of this I guess we lost them three times or some agreed. shit. The punishment stands. So this is it. Bubble below ground. That's real question. Also, this was a, a cheating thing. Because we couldn't survive that battle. That That's like basically plot armor but against us. Like technically, I would have survived, right? But because I use healers, right? But it, didn't, it just didn't. I never thought things would end like this. However, everyone involved in the duel demonstrated a remarkable level of strength and determination. In light of this, I'm prepared to change the method of execution. Okay. Elwar, the bottled flames I gave you for safekeeping. Do you still have them? And now... The horror reveal? Y yes. What horror? I wasn't sure what they were for, but I kept them super safe. I didn't lose a single one. Wonderful. Then, in just a moment, I'll have you administer them. Bottled flames? Indeed. They're the product of a secret experiment. Under certain special <clears throat> circumstances, flames can be extracted from my person this and preserved. This one. Once ingested, searing pain will spread across every inch of your body. No harm will come to you physically, but your memories will be burned away. I want five bottles, Nave, please. In a shot glass, ideally. Or just put it in my Coke. I don't give a fuck. I'm drinking that. I'm axing that shit, okay? If you can withstand the pain, when you awake, I want the pain. You'll have forgotten everything you know about the House of the Hearth, and will be expelled yeah, nice. from the organization. And one that you're missing. Okay, so she has done a very good. I mean, not good, but bad, good, 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 bad one. Um, experiment, which is, I like, I like it. In other words. She's basically Yugi and doing the mind crush kill thing. The version of you that grew cool. up in the house and give you a new identity. So this is why she was at Nubility and did the thing with the rivers. That makes all sense now. Memory is a mysterious thing indeed. Losing a portion of your memories will alter Can your you sense of Can you stick down away, you squid? Squid, get out of my face! This squid is actually starting to piss me off. Can we stop getting my face? <clears throat> squid, get out of my face, please. So, you're just... Letting us go, father? Yeah, but you don't know, dipshit. You misunderstand. Go, Memories are extremely I need important. One more. Once consumed by flame, the version of you standing before me will die. And our secrets will die with you. <clears throat> so no, <clears throat> I don't intend to just let you go. Because the person who survives will be nothing but a stranger. Even so... Even so... <laughs> I won't have to live in fear anymore. Yeah, I'm as fuck. I, just I mean, get, um, Fontaine done. To be fair, I think Go she on. should be old enough for this shit to not matter at all anymore. Considering she will have just a new, completely new personality and whatnot, and she's looking like NPC anyways. What's the point, right? Like they have fought your fair in fucking Fontaine City. I'm sorry, Father. I'm sorry I let you down, but I. I really... 
Also, she kind of looks good for a fucking NPC, not gonna lie. Don't cry, filial. I need to wait 30 seconds, 30 something seconds, before I can actually, like, go You and, haven't left the house yet, so there um, are still rules to be followed, yes. Again, so I'm just gonna go Remember what I taught you. Statue, so Anger can. makes you impulsive, sorrow causes you to waver. I have a fit. Don't let yourself be controlled max by your emotions. With the Fontaine statue. Of course. Holy I'll shit! Remember. I regret it all. <laughs> Dry your tears and go a pursue the level. life you really want. Good shit. I've completed it. Oh god. And how many? Uh, do you have an extra one or not? No, I'm I'm waiting for my thing to be done. Counting down. Oh, okay. Because it's still on countdown. Yes, Fair. I think I still have enough. I think I had 10 or some shit. So basically I can... Tomorrow I will collect all Kuli. And then I have to do the video. And the day afterwards. Which is problematic because there's Honkai Impact 3rd update tonight. So I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Fucked with this. I mean I was right. The I got... All the ones underground I, I gotten. All the ones underground I gotten. That's good. I mean it's I always one on the mountains. Yeah, I Elwar. Take them back the to ones Kossar. I couldn't find... And bring Link uh, like the ones and I didn't have, as well. like I couldn't actually find, were all above ground. Hmm. On the mountain? Uh, no. That's a surprising. I couldn't find all uh, in the weird subspace that's like, um, you know the one with the big tower? Yes. Like the area with the big ass. The under, tower under, the underwater one, yes. Yeah. That yeah. one is, like, it's like around there, pretty much is where it was. Two of them. Um, in in the middle of the air. I don't think so. Yeah, then it's underwater, I guess. Cause one of them was um, one in the one of these little tiny um, stone thingy millimeter bubbles, and I had to like change water levels and everything so I can actually go and claim it. Hmm. And I just apparently didn't notice that I didn't do it, I guess. And for some reason thought I had the occupy. Skill issue. Pokey check. I should pokey catch. I think I have to ultra ball that one. Because I don't know what the weekly mission was anymore. Where am I? That's what I'm asking myself every day, man. I prepared three extra vials of bottled flames. As for whether to take them, the choice is yours. I mean, they want to stay in the house of heart. Because they have high. she has high expectations for them. Goodbye, children. The next time we meet, I will no longer be your father. Thank you for all you've done for the house. I hope you have bright futures ahead of you. Dude, Alex, she's a nice person. I can't believe it, man. I thought she would be like the baddest betty on of all baddies. But no, it makes sense. Since she hated the doctor, it was for me generally not making any sense just to kill the fucking world. Fuck world right? It makes no fucking sense to me. That was, was something that was hey. bothering me the entire fucking time. Because it makes no sense. Just imagine, one day they will grown, be grown up, and what do they do then? Okay? It just makes no sense. You can't just kill them all. It makes no fucking sense. <coughs> like, you would get... I did it! Fucked over. Grats, dude. I finally got them all. Thank <coughs> God. I mean, she's in a great spot, kinda. Actually... Not really good, not really bad. Uh, it depends on how you see it. But she's... She's more on the bad side than on the good side, yes. But if it's about the house of the heart, it's diffy. It's just diffy. That, that she's just good, okay? Like, she's not really bad. Like, she punishes people and she tests them and, like, brain rots them into fucking redditors, right? So they'd be living on the streets then afterwards. Great homeless people. Let's go. It's that's what she's trying to do. She's trying to contribute to the homeless people. 70 30, See, bad great, good. Yeah, sounds about right. She's a great person. She's a great person. She's contributing to the homeless people. Yeah. By making more of them. Exactly. Here, grab my arm, Lenny. The more there is, the more there, the more chance to be successful. Ones. Shut the fuck up, Fold. Fold, you motherfucking piece of fucking shit. If I I would I would bang the fucking thing out of your fucking head, man. I, I hate this little green haired fucking shit. I wanna kill him. Thank you. Same. I wanna, oh, no, I wanna bump him. I wanna. Lynette, give me my Lynette. I hate him. I hate him. Give me my Lynette. Give me my Lynette. Clevy, time to Lynette. fucking die. Time, time to take a shot. I'm gonna cry. 
I'm gonna go and sh and jump off a fucking bridge. Terrible. I'm gonna go jump off a bridge. I no period period moment. Yeah. I now have C6 Zhongling. Can we talk now? I wanna cry. I've been waiting for a super long time. Like it wouldn't surprise me if she's trying to give her the the, the fire juice as well, but it, it's obviously not gonna be working. So I think her talking to um Peria makes more sense. Because because of this shit, she will just disappear among the sea of butterflies and lose not fast. How come you Man, did not? So did you? Because oh, you're why dumb. Why can't I get it? Somehow travel to the future. Why couldn't I get one? Why couldn't I get one? Why do I have to get fucking Zhongling? <clears throat> what a long dream. I got a second Zhongling. Great suit. I now have C6 Zhongling. Neither. Amazing. You died, Clairvy. Fucking bitch. That's what happened. I swear to God, if I get her again, I'm going to choke her to death. You little fuck, what? You died. You dead, bitch. I wish you would die, <laughs> fucking Zhongling. <laughs> You could at least sugarcoat it. Look, she's dead speechless. Now she's so pissed off about that. Then I would say she probably had enough lives. Wait, what? Oh. Uh, oh. Oh, okay then. Okay then. Yeah, okay. Happened. Huh? That's she just it? Accept you accepted it just like that? Yeah, why not? Paimon, it's just, it's, it's simple. Yep. Yep. If that's what Perry says happened, now how the then fuck I believe her. Perry wouldn't lie to me. Plus, I don't think she's gonna Really need to know why I'm like this. Apparently, I'm missing two ceilings in this area, but I don't know where the, the fuck the ceilings are, honestly. If you're a harbinger now, Perry, that means Mother is gone, isn't she? Yep, I necked her. I Can destroyed you her. tell me about it? I booty I blast. What happened to her. She's gone. And to me. You never stopped trying to defy fate. <clears throat> At first, no one believed you. You could only vent your frustrations to the moon. In fact, you often sought comfort in the night sky. You wanted to see the aurora. So one night, we promised each other we would go to Snezhnaya to see it together. Snezhnaya. Later on, Dark you Comrade. tried to run away, but you were brought back each time. This is going to take ten years. Mother spared your life, but it wasn't out of kindness. Instead, she decided to make an example of you by slowly torturing you over time. That way, the other children would know what happens to traitors. Still, you never gave up. Mother hoped that through ruthless duel after ruthless duel, she would be able to crown an ultimate victor among the children she raised. But you called on everyone to unite, to fight to a draw in order to reduce casualties. Your efforts may have only delayed the inevitable, but still. You gave them hope. You tried everything you could think of, but every attempt ended in failure. Still... You never turned your sword on Crucibina, and you never turned it on me. Man, I need to find where the fuck these, um... On that gloomy day, um, you told me. For the last 16 Lizar? years of my life, I've done everything I can to fight for freedom. But now, I realize that the only freedom I truly possess is the freedom to choose to die. Damn, that's fucking wild. Imagine being 16 years old and be like that. I would say was totally like me that. back then as well. It must have been feeling really worn down. Hey, do mind, apparently, I'm just gonna go do the hyper -boom thing. Apparently, nice. No, that I can but do that. Somehow, I still uh, think I, I understand. Enemies with hyper -boom According to Mother's plan, only one end. of us was going to make it until the end, and I always hoped that person would be you. I mean, she looks dead as fuck, and her eyes is like. If I could do it all over she again, needs a nap. I still don't think I would make a different choice. Even when I first met you, I knew you'd be able to do what I couldn't. Is that so? 
Even now, I'm not sure I truly understand what kind of freedom you were trying to pursue. But as the head of the House of the Hearth, and as the children's father, I've tried to give them the most basic of freedoms. The freedom to choose their own fate. It's something I discussed with the Udex of Fontaine. The children who want to leave the house will have their if memories I wiped clean of all secrets pertaining to the organization. I need to equip Yao Yao and return, make sure she has nothing on. They will be on. allowed to live a normal life in Fontaine so without being prosecuted for their past. She has one piece course, on. I don't think it's going to matter too much. I will hand freedom to them Once on a silver weapon, though, platter. So she has they have like to fight nothing. for it and prove themselves worthy of it. Only freedom that is earned has true What's value. That's four eight eight. Okay. Seven, That's six. more than enough. That's exactly the course, kind of life I was fighting for. Wasn't stacked. You know, Perry. My Kuki. I is think you're stacked. a pretty amazing king. Be fine. And a really great father too. Aww. I'm really you, happy that you're the one who you, took over the house. And Kuki. I guess I do have Kuki. one regret though. I still have not seen the outside can't take world. Damage from Kuki Shinobu, you little right? fucking bitch! You are at the outside world. What are you talking about? You're right there, you fucking moron. Are you dumb? Well, Why do we never get so any of these? It just so happens that our dear guests over here have been to many nations and traveled to countless places. She doesn't see the world, she doesn't see Perhaps shit, she's burned as fuck, man. Would be willing to tell you what the outside she's world basically is sun. like. And we're saying, she opened the window, yeah. That's true. Really? Traveled all over the place. We got so many stories. We could probably talk your ears off for three days straight. Yeah, like the time we got bodied by fucking archons left and right. The moment we had to fucking fight two dragons. No, no, wait, three dragons. Sumeru was one as well. And then, yeah, it was kind of funny. And then there are these harbingers, you know, these little pieces of shit. There's this redhead, okay? Basically. Whenever he sees us, he talks about his fucking children, not children, um, his brother and sister, and wants to fight us. Like, he's mentally ill. Yeah, he's mentally ill, that's for sure. Oh, shit. About what country do we talk? Land of Animal, Geo, Electro, or Dendro? Fuck, man. Um, Kusa Dotali, it I is. Was easy. Too afraid to skip mother's yeah. fighting lesson. And she just ignores it, man. She fucking ignores it. Like, we can't even speak of. Nah, man. I hate this kid. I want to punch her. Yeah. For who? The academia? Oh, no, I bet you could do all sorts okay. of secret things in class. Things that have nothing to do with studying. What did you say, Dawn? What? I said for who? Uh, it's it's story. Clavier. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, like, I thought <laughs> they were gonna kidding. ask, like, who is the Being best author? Easy. Whatever you want. Nita? Without having to fear for your life. It, it's sadly not that simple. Actually, sounds pretty you great. See? Let's go for Animal next because fuck Raiden. You know, I used to dream of being a bard. <laughs> I used to dream of being a bard. Oh my god. Playing the lute while singing into the winds of freedom. Oh, Even if there was no one there to listen, I would have continued to sing no oh, matter what. <clears throat> Please don't ever sing, Clavia. I don't want to hear this shit. Oh, okay. I have to do only two and then I can go for Hydro. That's interesting. But let's do all of them. Ah, that's where Mora comes from. I never knew that before. If I had some Mora, I would buy three new dresses. One for me, one for Perry, How do you still mispronounce her name? What's that? Clavier. What? Also, I don't give a fuck about her. She's you she's an, dude. She's an NPC. She's an NPC. To me, she basically has a number. Okay, she's NPC number sixty nine for twenty. There you go. Hope you're happy. It's a bit high, but alright. Bitch with praise as well. Like yeah, she's probably um. Um, 400 for 10 68 like or some shit <laughs> I guess I just have to keep them all for me then oh I can God, wear a so different one every day I could basically be hardcore insane and just say okay fuck Raiden use this piece of shit those yokai oh 
The Ottomans pronounce Pierre. What? Pierre. 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 Dude, are you deaf? No, I'm not paying attention to you. I'm too focused on. Yeah, see, I told you. What? Exactly. I once saw a drawing of this one guy with horns on his head and a super scary face. Are there any yokai like that? <laughs> oh no! He's talking about Ito! No! He's actually talking about fucking Ito. Nah, okay. Now I understand why Ito wasn't the thing. Yeah. Oh, sounds like you're talking about Nodi. Yep, we've yep. met one and let Paimon tell you. They're not nearly as scary as they look. He's yeah, dumb as fuck. They're the dumbest pieces of shit you can fucking imagine. The situation was super dangerous. Lenny and Lynette were accused of committing a crime, and they were going to have to stand trial at the Opera Epicles. Oh no. Oh, that no. must have been hard for all of you. What happened next? We fought a fucking whale. Uh huh. Yes, that's what we did. We, fi we fought a whale, okay? It's a weird subspace dog shit fucking thing. That dog shit whale. It basically one shots you and then he eats you and after he eats you you're fighting a knight why you don't know i don't know who cares and after that you get you get out of his asshole or some shit to fight them again because lying on the ground because stomach issues and you kill the fucking whale which is not legal in japan to whale hunt anymore anyways we still do it because fuck the laws we have money um yes I mean, we're, we're above, we're above all cons. Who gives a fuck? Don't worry. We were able to turn the situation fuck around super quick. Oh my god. Oh no, Paimon has a fucking... Paimon, of course. <laughs> Detect Paimon. That's what we needed. How'd you do that? Come on, tell me. Oh, wait, actually. It was there for the iridescent... Arataki, Rocking for Life, Two of the Force of Awesomeness. Yeah, something like that. That sounds like something he would say. Let me guess, that's the name of the event that's coming. I guess we in Baguette Land, so cares about Japan law. That is also true. <coughs> okay. yeah, French so love. As long as we're not burning baguettes, magic show, we to we're the good. Okay. And... Oh, so don't pronounce every second word like shit and you'll be fine? Shadows don't have the capacity to learn or grow. Any new information they encounter is quickly forgotten over time. The sun has risen. Oh no. Why is sun not in the chat now? Would be too amazing. Oh no. Image number two. You've worked tirelessly from the shadows to overthrow the house of the hearth. Now, by my authority as the knave, I shall announce how this matter ends. You are hereby expelled from the House of the Hearth. You are no longer tied to this place. Nor are you bound by its rules. I get the achievement, and then after I get the achievement, I'm doing my other wish, and then I'm not gonna get any one end. I'm gonna get to sleep. Can I? experience the outside world as well? Oh, I almost forgot. Oh, I almost forgot. I'm dead. May we meet again someday. Where are we? Like that has to be two, right? That has to be two. Amazing. Fucking amazing. She left so <coughs> soon. Paimon didn't even get to finish her story. 
What amazing animation, man. I also have certain sentiments left unsaid. I wanted to tell her that the aurora I saw in Snezhnaya was just as beautiful as the ones in the pictures. But a shadow's memories reset at dawn. Had we delayed any longer, we wouldn't have had the time to say goodbye. But a shadow's memories reset at dawn? Why do they reset at you? Huh? Wait, what? Why? A shadow's memories reset at dawn. So they reset at you. Why? Why? Um, because they start off with Sarna and then they end with me because you see what happens is what they actually are is words coming from sun and then they stop they end with me because i'm like what the fuck are you on son and then we all realize that he's on crack cocaine oh, okay fair whatever regrets may linger let them be lost to the coming of a new day oh my god father <coughs> okay he's already fucking dying nice good shit Is he neat? Huh? Paimon, you forgot to say the second part. What? 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 what, what? Where? What is he doing back here? Let's go check it out. What? I'm so confused. Exactly. This is how I'm right now. I'm confused. What the fuck this game wants me to do? Yeah, I just. And the others. What others? Where are they? Hello. Nobody's here, man. Maybe the no fucking notes. I go and equip. Uh, Father, the I bottled know. flames EMs. have been administered. Just level one EM science. Filial and the others and just, have like, level left the house. Um, now let me let me just equip some. XRP oh, you didn't drink the you. shit. Are you dumb? What have you decided? <clears throat> Thank you for giving us that choice, Father. Wow, but He's so cracked. We never wanted to leave the house. Oh my God, it's the my only home cracked. we've ever known. Lynette and Fremine feel the same way. They're recuperating so back at the like hotel booth. 400 today. attack and like 200 but yen. I decided oh to come God, back and so tell crap. you where we stood. Amazing. I'm sure you're well aware of the expectations I have for you. Yeah, just I want you to Arbor, follow in my footsteps and become the As next always. king of the house. I'm not. Yet you seem what, to have what, different dude, ideas. I expect it to at least be fucking Fremine and not whatever. I mean, somewhat expected. He's a five star after all, right? I must admit, I'm rather surprised by your decision to stay. There's nothing wrong with choosing to live a quiet life. Leading this organization is a heavy responsibility. One not so easily carried by someone forced onto the throne. I just... Never understood what you saw in me. Oh my god, are you telling me that what made literally you I was Nikita, that throne? even with level one artifacts and shit, is so fucking strong that she can that she just kills everything still? Good shit. And yet unequip everything. Oh god. You're brave, talented. And it's, it's, it's very surprising. It's him. You cherish your family. You would do anything to protect them. Even if it costs you your life. What's my Barbara using? <laughs> Barbara, where are you? You can't be using much. I'm just using the Witsith. Okay, you know what? You're not using the Witsith anymore. Speaking up back there was so use, brave of you, Linny. Uh, it's all thanks to you that we were able to convince Father to back down. Notes, <clears throat> as well as he does use You're a notes. hero, Linny. Um, my writing doesn't matter. I still want to fucking kill your dumb ass. Die, you little green air piece of shit. Hero. Father is That's the real fun. hero. Had father gone all out during the duel, there's no way I would have walked away with my life. She, she didn't must have had it all no, planned my... from the beginning. She had bad. From the very moment she suggested a duel. I'm not deserving of that title. I mean, yeah, she's playing 5D chess. Not strong enough. Or smart enough. Which sounds even weirder because we talk about Linny right now. You're wrong. 
In my opinion, all you need to be deserving of the throne is conviction and the necessary strength to act on it. We may have different ideas of what it means to be a family, but you can hardly be said to lack conviction. What you truly lack is strength. For someone of your talent, though, that's something that will come with time. So basically, have fun solo leveling, you little fucking shit. Even without that strength, you still chose to face me in a duel, even though the odds were stacked against you. That capacity to oh, honor your convictions is what I truly see in you. Father. No one knows what the future holds. 13 adventure XP till AR 58. Being at the head of this Wait, you're not even AR 60? Strength of will to face God comes. damn. Okay, well done. Oh, 13k. Okay, yeah, then. It's a few days. How much was a day? I think it was like... It's like 2,000 or some shit? Yeah, I think a little bit more. With resin, it's like... I think 3 or some garble. Could be wrong. If reaching a certain standard were required to go so after like what five, you want, six days, I would never maybe. have succeeded in killing my Worst case. Processor. Back then, there was still Did a considerable gap that, or is, between our Or is the game so fucking stupid that it didn't give me one from that? I actually hate strength this shit so much. Oh my god, I hate this shit so much. Strength may decide the ultimate victor, but those who let a lack of strength okay. dictate well, their decisions the or undermine their convictions will never be worthy of the throne. I understand, Father. Where's my Yao Yao? Thank you. Yao Yao, where are Children you? Children must grow up to surpass yow, yow. their parents. Where are you, yow, yow. Only then can a family continue to flourish. The road ahead is not an easy one. So I'll ask you one I last time. I need to, time. like, remove everything on Candace as well. Are you Holy certain shit. This is going to suck, but stay. I kind of need to do it this way. Oh, it You've done so much seconds. for me, Father. And that kindness must be repaid. Plus, with Project Stuja at hand, there are many dangers ahead, and I, for one, don't intend to back down. I still have no idea what that Project Stuja is. No clue. Protecting my family at all costs. <clears throat> That's my conviction. Then you're welcome to stay. As for Project Stuja, you need not be too concerned. If those cowardly <coughs> businessmen and heartless <clears throat> dignitaries try to take us down, I'm prepared to teach them a lesson. Oh, God, no. Having members who longed for the light was our organization's last weakness. With those members no longer among our ranks, the House of the Hearth is like a spider hiding in the shadows. We need only wait this for our prey to come to us. You, you, and you. There's no way it goes At wrong, present, right? Our There's no way. Is to use their plan to our advantage. In doing so. A crimson moon shall rise amid the frigid speed, blizzards of winter. Towards, no demonstration of loyalty and shall go e, unrewarded, and, and no sacrifice and shall Q. be in vain. As for the two of you, whether we meet again as friend or foe, I'll remember the camaraderie we shared in this moment. They want to use the members of the House of Risky Missions to weaken the House. Because I don't like an organization. Like that is not fully under the control. That's basically a plan. Uh-huh. No matter how arduous the journey ahead, I hope we both reach our desired destination. Wait until two days later. Gotta love that shit. Like please give me shit. I swear this game does not. Why is the game? I don't know. Why is the game? Where's the game? When is the game? Who's the game? The game hates me. I like it a lot, man. It was easily 10 out of 10. The fight was kind of weird. <clears throat> but that's a bit. That's like a little bit iffy. Maybe we should go check on them. That's how they're doing it. If they're going to do it that way, I'm going to do it that way. 
The battle was like super how, awkward to me. Shuri carried you sword. I know, man. <laughs> Shuri was like, okay, let's delete the enemy. This is proof that uh, everyone should pull Shuri, right? I agree. You people underestimate her way too fuck much. At my extremity, uh, yeah, it took me much longer. Yeah, I mean, Feminine? Feminine? to be fair, my Shuri ult does 100k, E does 50k, puppets does 25k. And they hit twice every two and a half seconds or some shit. So it's like. I'll bring a second. 600,000, 607,000 damage and mostly off heat. With not much setup. Like, she's crazy good, okay? Needless to say, she's crazy fucking good. Who could have guessed? Much better. Also, it could be possible that Akshino has uh, power resistance. So you, you do quite a lot less damage. But I'm not too sure. Whew, what a relief. <laughs> but considering she's do this she's pyro with pyro delusion, that's double pyro. Uh, she's basically four times weak to water, ground, and rock types. So, you know, I have a slight advantage. She has. I did way low damage against her. Yeah, I expected that. What about you? But do you know what that I'm means? Not feeling all right? I can use Yomia. Okay. Just to flex. Like I'm claiming. I knew you'd come out unscathed. <clears throat> Us, <clears throat> on the other hand, well, we've been bedridden for two days. I couldn't even turn over. A friend got beaten up. And I did the weekly boss. I used Nivility. Yeah, I mean, that's four times weakness as well. She get, basically got fucked by that. I want to sleep so bad, dude. Yeah, I'm I'm oh, done soon, I hope. And I wanted to ask, is <laughs> Claire V <clears throat> gone? Linny and the other members have Man, left like, the saw and returned to the House of the Hearth. To According to him, there haven't like been any more sightings right of a spirit roaming the house. I feel like Borgium would be a lot easier in Hyper Bloom at this point. Just because it is a. I see. You just crashed again, right at the moment you were speaking. I want to get rid of. I want to be done with this I'm cool glad. shit, but. Oh. Father came to check up on us two days ago <clears throat> and told us about what happened with Crusabina and Clairvy. Actually, I. I've met Crusabina before. Wait, what? He met her? Wait, what? Wait, what? You've met the former knave? Crucibina died a year after Clairvy. It was during the year between their deaths that I joined the House of the Hearth. Oh. Okay. Crucibina had an extremely cruel and radical way of doing things. While she was alive. That's interesting. I didn't know. House Obviously joined suffocating. before Arla was harbinger. We knew that. Not really. <laughs> When I joined, though, the experiment she valued so it much is surprising had to me at least. to an end, and all the people involved, that at least me one. dead and it's injured the alike, fuck. What the fuck is this game are gone. Man? <clears throat> Cruz Sabina never talked about the past with us. I guess I gotta change two characters, which I really don't want to do, but I guess I have to, just so it's easier. Love it. I don't know. I have Sayu. I could just use. A couple of months after I joined, I mean, I don't read his. Father killed I didn't read Christina his story shit, so maybe files. it was mentioned in there. With that, there's a chance to for all the people subjected to her you experiments. Claire V included were lost to the flames. As I give what EM pieces, along with the painful memories they represent. Why, do, why does she have DPS pieces on? <laughs> what is she Father doing with DPS money pieces? Me a couple months after that. But she you know what, she never can take, mentioned uh, anything like about Crucibina or Clarity. I'm just gonna go press EM and press something to use. Mm. It really seems like something she was planning to keep to herself. The last time you talked to her, did she mention why she kept it a secret for so long? I mean, it's a new start for her. She was like basically traumatized as well. She said she didn't want us to be affected by the darkness of the past. Yeah. She was worried we'd develop a false sense of gratitude towards her if we knew about it. 607 should be good enough, pretty much. The foundation of a family should be free of any corrupting influence. 
Whatever happened in the past, it has nothing to do with who we are now. And that's what father told oh, us in the end. But I still thanked her for I everything. It was only after hearing about what Crucibina did Brick that I finally realized how insignificant our lives could have been. Angel blooms on the, the members go. of the house like, meant nothing bam. to her. To say that she valued them in any way. Yeah, there's no way I did not. There's no way I did not give me it. That was within two seconds credit. I killed five people. If it was like within a second. Taken over the house of the Is Joey actually going to be really useful to me I right here? probably would have already. What? How? Father what the fuck? Really brings I'm so up the fact I'm actually that she so fucking pissed. I'm so You're pissed. pissed. Chill. I need my being indebted to her. I need my story. Why does this not? I do it. And then it doesn't go up. But even if we didn't what does owe this game her want anything, for me? we would still choose to stay. Because this is our home. We may have arguments or times when we feel wronged. You wait for a few. Some people may even choose to leave. But as long as father is here, we will always have a home. Whether the path before us is bathed in sunlight, or shrouded in shadow. We'll follow Father wherever she chooses to go. <clears throat> so I wanted to say thank you for helping us make it through this <clears throat> crisis. Without your help, we could have lost a lot more along the way. Oh, we didn't do anything, really. Of course, you're welcome anytime. Are Filial and Nantoy okay? I actually saw them at a cafe this morning. They didn't recognize me. From what I could tell, they were drinking coffee and talking about one of the operas that started running recently. <laughs> it's so kind of hilarious. They, they suddenly have a new life. Happy. If I had to take a guess, I would say they finally found the kind of life they always wished for. Aww. That's the end. I knew it. That felt like an end. Was a good end. That was amazing. I, well, did you just get a fireplace? Okay. I really like the end. <clears throat> and I got Guide of Order. So I can.